wanted to say that you did give me a challenge to flavor what I have with base mechanics, and oh boy, I have. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. All right, everybody, welcome to, uh, I guess, my second mythic playtest. We'll just jump right into the story. So, players, you find yourselves in the city of El Terrell on Feyrun, about eight months after the, we'll call it the Avernus event. For anybody unfamiliar, that would be the Descent into Avernus module. The city still features many states of destruction from the colossal event that encompassed it all those months ago. And since then, because of the choices that a man by the name of Krieg made, the city's worship of the god Torm has shifted. And it shifted in the direction of the Raven Queen, goddess of death herself. As they believe, or at least no longer believe in Torm's gracious powers to bring their long-lost loved ones back to life. And they seek a new deity to right the unnatural wrongs that were committed during that calamity. The party wasn't necessarily involved in the event, unless you choose otherwise, but has been pivotal in the reconstruction of El Terrell and also the elimination of any remaining devils or fiends that tried to hitch a ride when the city was turned to the material plane. Today, you find yourselves ascending the steps of a tall, gothic cathedral, a temple dedicated to the Raven Queen, with the intention of meeting up with the High Priestess within the city of El Terrell by the name of Zariah. I will post a picture of Zariah real quick. Everybody see that? She cute. Where at? <laughs> she looks she... like she's incredible abs. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yes, this... Is that a lantern of revealing? Oh my god. Who knows? Uh, but this beyond pale snow white skin, pitch black eyes and snow white hair. You would know her as someone who has been preaching of the Raven Queen's powers in the city streets for quite some time. And it seems over the previous months that she has been given some generous donations by many no remaining nobles within El Terrell to build this new temple. Love the sound effect. Shit, did that actually get caught, picked up? My bad. No, <laughs> it's so much liturgy in the background. Your character's just munching on chips before they go in. Yeah. yeah it's crushing ice between their teeth. That's canon. That's canon. It's canon. Yep. But as you ascend the stone steps on this hill that somewhat overlooks the vast city before you, the Chanterelle River, River yep, I can talk, the Chanterelle River, uh, wide and deep, um, kind of towards the south of the city. As you open the large double doors, you immediately notice that the pews are chock full of people garbed in pitch black robes of mourning, as Zariah herself guides them in prayer. The doors shut with a soft thud behind all of you that echoes a little bit more loudly than you were hoping through this grand hall. But nonetheless, the prayers continue unabated, and Zariah soon finishes it with a final sentence. Ah, queen, 
shrouded in the shadows of death, look upon our memories and show us your favor. The mourners sit quietly as Zariah peels back a veil of shadow and beckons to all of you to approach the, uh, the podium. And as you all begin to walk forward, there is a muttering of whispers amongst the worshippers, their various voices filled with fear. So, as all of you approach the podium where Zariah stands, why don't we go ahead and have some character introductions? State your name I would like, and I would... what your character looks like. Uh, it sounds like James wants to go first. Shocker. I, I was going to ask <laughs> to go last, actually. Oh, okay. <laughs> wow. All right. He, he, he's going first to go last, apparently. <laughs> Yikes. All right. I guess we'll go by... Um, uh, alphabetical order according to screen names. So we will start with Baton Man. Who are you playing tonight? So, first down the aisle, black hair parted down the middle, caressing over the sides, covering the pointed tip of his uh, half-elven uh, kinship, is Lucius Van Rex. Uh, he carries a very nice, yet worn set of plate armor carries the lens Felgard shield on his left side and always with his right hand on the long sword at his hilt. He looks very much like the face on his token, like he doesn't trust anything or anyone, and he always walks by his good brother Kentrel. Hell yeah. And he just kind of leads the pack, but tentatively and carefully waits that the group goes as a unit. Hell yeah. All right, I believe next that will bring us to Joe. Who are you playing yes. tonight? Uh, the returning Gallifrey Zafir. Um, he is a black uh health half elf uh human wizard oh, sorry half elf uh half elf uh, wizard um he's a researcher studious type um rocks a staff in one hand and a rapier on his hip cool next i believe that'll bring us to manny all right, so Kintrell is a, um, he's a human paladin. He um, is your very stereotypic looking paladin, wearing shining golden armor um, of what looks to be like a dwarven nature, just despite him being human. Um, he's got long flowing brown hair and a large beard. Very serious look. Hell yeah. All right, that will bring us to no. Uh, no is a tiny owlin cleric, um, just a little tiny owl, and she's probably just like flopping, like flying over y'all. Um, just small, very chipper, and this is part one of my plan. DM, would we, would you say we know each other from before or no? That is up to you. If you want to be a newcomer to the group, or if you want to know the rest of the party and been a part of eliminating any fiends or devils that are remaining after the descent into Avernus, that is, yeah, it's your decision. So check it out, guys. Who wants to get married for a plus two AC and um, top <laughs> Please marry James. Please marry the crazy. No, no, that's not how I wanted to introduce myself. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I was, I was actually going, we're in a cathedral. Um, if we say we like, or we're in a polyamorous relationship and we're going to go to a final oh battle, we could just get married right now and then. It's the perfect setting. So romantic. The best honeymoon. Oh, it's going to be a hoot. Wow. Do you support polyamorous relationships? 
I yeah, do. Yeah, GM, what is your stance on polyamory? You, okay, supports it. <laughs> I do support. I I don't take part in polyamory, but I don't <laughs> mind anybody else who does. Listen, all more power no to shame. Them. Polyamory is very difficult. <laughs> the lines of communication that must remain open are truly significant. Yes. Um, but yeah, 100%. which would anyone? The would everyone just like to, political. <laughs> would would the entire party would like? Kid, I mean, I think we have brothers. I don't know if and that would be weird, but. I mean, would yeah, everyone want to get married to one single person, and then the brothers don't get married to each other? Like, like, can we arrange multiple marriages? I don't know, DM, up to you. Well, the funny we thing is... Two, we also he said he paladins. supports polygamy. The, the funny thing is, is that according to the spell, it says you would touch adult humanoids willing to be bonded together in marriage. It doesn't specify how many. So the spell yeah. does support polyamory. <laughs> <laughs> I think, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to say no to because you don't know me before this. You don't know my character before this. No worries. Also, just FYI, if you want, if you are a young kid who is who's becoming an adult, I have coming of age. I can do that coming for you too. <laughs> Nikki is 19. I will help you know. Okay. Players. Okay. Let's let's. Get I don't know if you, I don't know if you'll have enough time to do that. Players I mean, let's, yeah. squeezing let's, let's every everything. advantage that they can get. <laughs> yeah, but I'm going to say, I'm going to, I'm you going to say you and... will probably not have enough time to do that, Tim. You came in and said ruthless, Myth. That's true. I did. <laughs> I did say it was ruthless. So those of you who would like to enter in a polar polyamorous, <laughs> I'd be married to I mean, Don I, I would also. Wing. <laughs> I would also say if if I'm I'm saying this now because I'm the next in line, but if you guys want to finish the intros and then decide, that might also be a good idea. That's, oh, thanks for oh, giving yeah. us time to think. That's about fair. This. Yeah, let's let, let's give let's <laughs> give people time. Marriage, marriage is a thing you, need, you usually should think about. Yeah, it's a yeah. very important contract. Um, and Wait if you guys want to think about it. Ends. I will give you all like basically a little booklet of like all the benefits of marriage, all the tax benefits you can have in multiple lands, like the discounts you can get, the property that you can. Yeah, just listen. I'm you see like I just like see like a little thing around my neck and just like I am a, a marriage counselor and a priest on uh, my spare time and I do a lot of weddings. Yes. <laughs> I feel like this is like the used car salesman who just found yeah. out that the sun is. I thought we only had one. I thought we only had a uh, budget for one James. <laughs> yeah, it's only I'm the one. Jesse too. Is James? What can I say? We just need a mouth. Nice. Very good. <laughs> nice. Very good. <laughs> All right. I'm good. All right. Uh, <laughs> believe that will bring us to um, Wraith next. Who are you playing tonight? <laughs> <laughs> yes, uh, so Zrash the Mighty <laughs> is a giant dragon board, uh, gem one. Uh, the, basically the picture uh, there, except he's actually more green because he's an uh, emerald one. Uh, he is a hulking figure, like walking through that door. He is uh, like seven, like three or something at this point. With Torium. <laughs> big old muscles and everything like that Fixed thank it. you thank you it's always nice I... <laughs> thanks uh but yes uh he is a big boy and he is carrying around a gigantic uh hammer like just like resting on his shoulders which is probably larger than the owl at this point and uh yeah he's also just randomly snacking and smashing down on a bunch of like chicken like legs that's what the crunching noise has been this chicken time. with the owl yeah <laughs> and just been tossing owl. them into owls his mouth eat and chickens crunching. owls yeah that owls is true are that is true. I mean, I, i'm pretty sure owls eat other owls if they're small enough yeah that's also true well yeah. no that's you're thinking of eagle owls oh yeah, yeah. it's owls yeah. owls yeah, owl, owl not so much. It's more like voles. It's harder to hunt something that's already flying midair versus on the ground. Yeah, two silent flyers trying to hunt each other. That sounds like a very tedious aspect. <laughs> <laughs> Monk versus rogue fighting. Yeah, it's essentially. Um, yeah, big old boy plated in some armor and got a lovely wild look of I don't give a shit. 
I'm here to punch things in the face. Hell yeah. That's what we're here for. All right. And um, <laughs> with much apprehension, uh, last and certainly not least, I suppose, uh, James, who are you playing tonight? <laughs> oh, as everybody enters the cathedral, you all see a massive portal go up in front on the ceiling and a guy drop down from it. <gasps> whoa, whoa, okay then. And then you see what appears to be a five, a six foot exactly man with a gi on, with a blue gi on. He has very spiky hair. And I will post his image in Mythic Playtest. He has a very, he's a man with very spiky hair with very defining features. He has gray boots on and uh, white gloves. As he looks around, what the hell is going on? Okay then. Well, hi there. Name's Negi. Uh, what are we all doing here? I I flew in here and I have no idea what's going on. I hate everything about who you are in this moment. <laughs> uh, oh my gosh, there is an owl. Did you know we have there? Did you know I, there's actually a mare that is a talking dog? Did you know that? They probably, probably. <laughs> Oh, uh, can I? Can I roll an insight check? <laughs> <laughs> roll an insight check. I, I have immediately lost control. I, I, I was like, he is telling the, the truth. <laughs> no, I was gonna like. I was. Just, I, I, I'm more inside. Like, is this guy? Is he this energy? Yes. Look, okay, okay. Uh, well, this you is see really Lu yeah. You see Lucius turns to Zrash and turns to Contrell and to uh, Gallifrey and he's like, deep thigh. <laughs> okay. The owl is just, Dawn's just looking. How old are you? I am 19. <laughs> oh, interesting. <laughs> I, but please, tell me, tell me what is going on. Bad things are going on. Get with the program, kid. Bad things? Well, Stompy Bad Things is my middle name. I actually don't that's, know my middle name. That's really long. It is like, my new middle name. Right? Like, how long does that need to write that? I mean, the uh, Spanish have multiple middle names, so... Do you have problems when you go to the DMV? <laughs> What's a DMV? <laughs> You see a little no port look like no, just slight <laughs> nosebleed, slight nosebleed from Lucius. Um, Ugh. I just okay. I hand you like a little handkerchief so you can wipe the blood off. Oh, thanks. Whoa, uh, you like, are tall, I pull, and I, you're green. You're like a certain person I know. That's not a very good guy. <laughs> Namekian, uh, Demon King, all that. Uh, this is a good time to ask who would like to be uh, engaged to be married. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Jesus. Uh, the answer to your question, what's going on, is a wedding. You and someone. Or multiple someones. Listen, I just need a list of people I can apply um, the plus two, give you the plus two to. Yes, informing Zariah of the situation and the uh, potential benefits from this, uh, you guys can take an hour to have a gothic wedding surrounded by these people in dark, black, hooded veils and robes. <laughs> Wonderful! Oh my gosh, and we didn't even need to pay for the decorations? You guys are so well prepared! Oh, I will what add you to the booklet. You're getting married. Like slaps. I'm shoulder. not getting married. Well, okay. You know no. what I'm married to? I'm married to practicing martial arts. That's what I'm married okay, wait. to. Well, okay. Out of out of character, who does want to get the plus two AC? Yeah, who does want to get married to Don? <laughs> I think we're good. I th I'm good. Thanks. No worries. Uh, I guess I'm going to throw <laughs> myself as tribute. <laughs> wait, which one are you, Wraith Lord? Which one are you? Zrash. I'm the. the, I'm, I'm the Oh, yes. Dragonborn. Yes. Oh, no. Okay. Uh, sorry. Can you tell me your name again for? Uh... Zrash the Mighty. 
Okay, so it's Rush. Yep. And um, Dawn. No one else. Anyone you don't have to get. Here? You don't have to get married to us. Like you can separately be married, and this could be like, like you know, just like a financial arrangement marriage. There's nothing in here that says you have to be in love and lay with each other. <laughs> now it sounds like you're a true saleswoman. Yes. <laughs> this, this is totally the used car salesman. Totally for tax purposes. No pressure whatsoever. I just came and here property. through a massive portal, and somebody's asking to marry me. This is. I don't Come know on, I kid, do it. Looking. Come on, kid. I mean, I, I, I can give you, you know, here's the thing. I can give you coming of age. So for the next 24 hours, whenever you make up ability check, you can roll a d4 and add it to your ability check. I think I'm good. Okay. Um. So this is just Rash and Dawn for the plus two. Just, just Rash and Dawn. It sounds okay. like. Great. All right. Okay. Cool. You both go down the aisle in uh whatever. <laughs> Got it. Uh, Lucius will officiate. Lucius can officiate. So there you go. Lucius officiates <laughs> as you guys have a epically goth wedding. Uh, <laughs> also, is. the size differential is amazing, right? Yeah, it, it is it, absolutely incredible. Yes. <laughs> Don, will you, in the presence of the Raven Queen and the Morning Lord, this year very evening, will take Rash the Mighty? as your lawfully wedded husband in sickness and health in monster or celestial for the rest of the days of your life. Oh, I, I am up and down. Definitely monster. <laughs> You're supposed to say I do. Yes, I do. Zrash the mighty. Will you take Dawn Gloaming as your lawfully wedded wife in sickness and health in monster and celestial till death do you part? Or until financially it is non sustainable anymore. <laughs> sure. You, you just like, hear Don. No, it's I trip. do. It's I it's the contract, man. You have to say I do. Yeah. You also ah, hear Don chirp out you also hear Don chirp out. It's also good for citizenship purposes too. Oh, come See, on, that, that's a low yes, blow. That's go, a yeah. fucking low that's a fucking low blow to Francisco. <laughs> I, by the power invested in me by the Morning Lord and the Raven Queen, I now pronounce you man and wife, or dragonborn sure you, and Alan. Make sure you have the plus two <laughs> or the override. Dragon and, bo and bird. Already gave it to the dragonborn. I am in the process of giving it to Dawn. <laughs> Role playing a wedding, something I did not expect to do today. No. Oh, I'm completely down for this. Let's go. Thank you, Myth. Thank you for this opportunity. <laughs> why Thank say, you, Myth. Why say no when I've made a boss fight that literally is trying to kill people? Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, and you, right. young man, would you like the plus four, D4, four for your... Uh... I, I, I think I'm good. Okay. And just turn to... Just so you know, if anyone still wants to get married later, just hit me up. Just let me know. Just hit me up. <laughs> Why do I have 19 uh, armor class now? Because I added it already. I had 20 to begin with. Hmm. Let me check. He's trying to play you. Hmm. Oh, no. That's what marriage will do to you. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, boy. <laughs> okay, so you should have 20. Not with a, well, with a good contract, it won't. She's putting, she's <laughs> making you put your guard down. She's going to take everything you have, Zrash. <laughs> No, I I probably like like has Rash like in a corner and explained everything and told him all the things that like your stuff will be yours after divorce and mine will be mine after divorce. There's like a very fair contract and here's a clause like I know it's really like short, but we also know each other for a while. But you know, if you want a lawyer to look at it later, that's a whole thing. Like absolutely, like that's already here in the thing. Like they can talk to them. This fantasy realm's pretty modern. <laughs> pretty progressive. <laughs> pretty progressive. Pretty progressive and modern. Polygamy. <laughs> like, like, and lawyers. The, 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 the three. Interest, three man. Lawyers have been here since antiquity, okay? I, I know, yep. but still, man, this is really advanced. Three seconds after you say that, Zarash goes, My stuff is whoever gets goes to whoever kills me. L Noted. L listen, <laughs> when demons come out of portals and God and the hierarchy of gods changes on a hundred year basis, you tend not to sweat the small stuff, right? Oh, so uh, the yeah. god thing is a democracy. Wow. <laughs> That's really progressive. Why is this world so progressive? 
like <laughs> Lucius goes, yeah, I ran for God of Paladins, like, t- like you know, 50 years ago at the last and rotation, and lost? I missed out for 10%. Oh, no, I'm sorry, buddy. All right, you all right. know, Ma, I didn't. I didn't hit the right demographics. The DM is flipping hey. the lever to bring this train back onto the rails. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, sure? guys, let's go off to defeat the evil. I don't know what's going on, but we need to defeat the evil. Well, DM, here's the thing: as I'm casting ceremony, that's an hour of casting, right? Can yes. I also cast Heroes Feast for our wedding um, for our um, dinner? Absolutely, yeah. absolutely. <laughs> okay. So, Everyone, uh, have some heroes feast. Uh, yes, uh, Don and Zrash get married. There is a hour long heroes feast to celebrate the occasion. Again, completely surrounded by people in black robes and veils. Um, but everybody is happy to take part to take their minds off of the dire situation that befalls them. And the DM does remember that two hours has now passed. Just kidding. And, uh, well, no, it's the same time. It's casting time 10 minutes, and then it's like an hour for ceremony. So, well, oh, yeah, no stars. But yeah, you could, you could technically, I could cast Hero's Feast, and y'all could eat as we do the ceremony. If it, you should be, if you should be anything, you should be efficient. Yes, <laughs> yeah. exactly. Taxes, man. Especially, especially um, also, married. everyone's, everyone's AC, um, uh, increases, not AC, sorry, uh, health increases by 10. Ah. Uh, hit point, yeah. hit point maximum, maximum up by two d ten. Yeah, so it's ten. Uh, I roll two d ten. It's ten. Nice. Oh, cool. oh yeah. okay. perfectly average. And um, this lasts for twenty four hours. You're now uh, immune to poison, being frightened. And you make all wisdom saving throws with advantage. Sick. All right, let's do it. All right. So after pigs in a blanket. After everybody has celebrated the wedding, had a grand feast along with all of our worshippers here. I'm also a chef, so you really enjoy the food. (laughs) Don, he just good at everything. (laughs) Um, Zariah resumes her place at the podium. I mean, I invite her to have some as well if she wants. uh, Absolutely. (laughs) She, She absolutely has some. And, just okay. fill her like stuff up with devil's eggs. Yeah, she just stuffs her face. Um, prayer is hard work. Lucius just pushes hungry. forward. Yes, what do we need to do? <laughs> <laughs> she says, Thank you for the ceremony. It has lifted our spirits. Now, as my worshippers know, I and my paladins have unfortunately come to the knowledge that our blessings and our magical gifts from the Raven Queen have left us. There's a little bit of murmur of frightened whispers that go through the crowd. And recently, I and several others have witnessed a vision. In this vision, there was a great raven flying through the sky, unheeded, until suddenly it was engulfed in shadow and black flame, or in gold flame, sorry, shadow and gold flame. I hand her a goblet of wine because it sounds like she's thirsty. (laughs) (laughs) She takes a quick sip, quick sips to uh, and clears her throat a little bit. Sorry, um, been praying out loud all day. But um, as this raven descended, it perished and landed in a nest. And as the flames dissipated, all that remained was a black egg. We have been puzzling over this vision for several days, and I have come to the the decision that I believe our goddess, our queen, has been in prison. With this in mind, I have asked our group here and our young newcomer 
nobody is even like flapped by the fact that somebody came through a portal. It's Faerun after all. <laughs> yep, that happens like every literal day. Didn't the whole city just go through a portal not that long ago? Yeah, exactly. Eight months ago, yeah. Everyone like it keeps looking up just in case there's a portal, so it's like, watch out! Whoop! <laughs> yeah, everybody's like looking out the window, just like, is that big fuck all portal gonna take us back to the hells again? Oh god. Uh... <laughs> there's probably like people like traffic wardens who are like, up oh, portal ain't coming. <laughs> <laughs> just a bunch of. Uh... Wizard just pop in the second portal incoming. <laughs> uh, but she continues, and she says, "During my time during the event, I only survived because of our queen's blessings. Our queen's blessings, queen's blessings, queen's play kind of whispers throughout the pews, and." Because of my steadfast dedication, she rewarded me with a little bit of a boon. And I believe that this boon will help you, and she gestures to the party, to help our goddess and return her to us. Return her to us, return her to us, kind of again whispers through the pews. As a part of this, Ritual. I believe I can send you to the culprit of our queen's potential imprisonment. Now, without wasting any time, let us commence. And Zariah holds her hands above her head. She closes her eyes for a moment. And you guys watch as shadowed wings emerge from Zariah's back and unfurl behind her, 40 feet from wingtip to wingtip. You see below your feet a magical circle flares with bright silvery light. And as this happens, Zaria opens her eyes and instead of the pitch black that you are familiar with, you see bright purple light, almost like two cones of pure energy just fill the entire space of the temple. You feel gravity and its influence le or release its grip upon your forms as you begin to hover 20 feet off the ground. The various- I'm already 20 feet off the ground, but okay. Fair enough. Uh, <laughs> you're 20 feet higher. You're at the ceiling. <laughs> you just see a smushed owl and be like, help me. <laughs> Uh, the various ro or yeah, the various veiled worshippers begin to just chant for the queen, for the queen, for the queen. And as I they do so, the yeah, <laughs> as they do so, you can see each of their eyes as well <laughs> open up in that same light that is coming from Zariah's eyes. Now, before all of you are plane shifted. There are some, you feel this, you feel innate connection to the weave, some more than others are, well, for some, a familiar feeling for, for, a familiar feeling for others, not as much potentially, but it fills you and just, you can feel this connection almost to the entirety of the network of magic that encompasses the planes and um, the material plane as well. What this means, or how this is going to work, is if anybody has any questions about anything that they are about to go into, you may ask, and I will ask for a particular skill check, and maybe I will answer your question. I will not. <laughs> All right. Neji has no questions. 
I do. Lucia, oh, sure. Go ahead. Oh, go, go ahead. On. You first. Oh, no, no, no. You go first. I'm actually looking something up right now. So, Lucia's is just like very curious about. We know of the celestial nature of this foe. What else can we glean from the fact that as an opponent of the Raven Queen, what can we expect? As you project this question into this flow of magic that pushes through you, you get a kind of a feeling of confusion kind of comes over you. It's too broad of a question to answer. Mm -hmm. Okay, Lucius will uh, recenter himself and be like, We have two brothers of the paladin variety. Will our radiant righteousness have an effect on this, or will we be wasting radiant resources on this foe? Ooh. <clears throat> Are you proficient in religion? I wish I was. Okay. I am. Um, you and that's, out? uh, well, this is internally for everyone as the magic kind of flows through them. Okay. Uh, so give me, I'll say, give me a spell casting check. Since Charisma this has check. to do, okay. yeah, since this has to deal with your innate abilities as a paladin. Okay. Oh, sorry, I'm rolling self. I rolled a 10. <laughs> yeah. Rolled a 10? Okay, you, this question kind of goes out. And in Zariah's voice, as you kind of like look down at this magic circle beneath your feet, still hovering off the ground, and you hear it, the voice begin to emanate from her, very much, uh, much louder and kind of echoes throughout. You even hear like some vague cracking of the windows that, um, of the temple as she speaks and responds to you. And she says, It is a solid possibility due to the celestial nature of this being. Well, that sucks. Thanks! <laughs> Any other questions? So I thought I took legend lore and I forgot when I was messing around so I don't have legend lore so it doesn't help us at all. I'm sorry. Damn. Um, I, w I, did, I did intend to take it and I just forgot as they shifted around. But, um, let's see, what was I going to do? Well, if it burns a spell slot, then I am okay with you marking off that spell slot. Yeah, no, 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 no. <laughs> hmm. I don't trust you to tell me the truth on this, unless the spell slot is going to make you tell me the truth. Ha. Ooh. <laughs> Damn! Hold out. <laughs> what if I cast Zone on Truth on this entire thing? Would you let me do that? Ooh. <clears throat> Here's what I'll say. Zone of Truth will lower the DC that you have to meet. Legend lore will lower the DC by even more. I'm gonna look at the others and just like look and like. Do you guys want? Do you guys have any other questions? Yeah. Gallifrey okay. I'll collapse. burn that. Yeah, I'll burn that legend lore then, if you'll let okay. me. It's okay. a fifth level spell, I believe. Okay. Yeah, I will. I will let you. I will allow that. <laughs> it is allowed. Tis allowed! Right, In Dawn. my infinite kindness. Uh, so, Dawn, as you focus, access that magic within you, feel that another surge of energy just flow through you and away from you and into this, into the weave itself and goes out. What is the question you would like to ask? Oh, well, I'm actually opening up to everyone else first. I'm just letting that possibility to everyone else if that's Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, I understand now. Okay. <laughs> Califrey will simply ask, known strength, known weakness. Known strength, known weakness. Hmm. Okay. 
I would say that the answer you would receive through Zariah would be their dedication to their god bolsters their resistances. Uh, so what that will translate to everybody is the boss you are fighting magic has resistance. no, uh, no, no magic resistance. The entity that you are fighting has aura of protection, and their greatest attribute, strongest attribute, is their charisma. Fuck. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that sucks. <clears throat> When you ask about weakness, the response that Zoraya echoes out from uh, as her as a mouthpiece, she says, how do I put this? How do you want to do this? <laughs> Here's how I'll put this. The message is muddled. The two words that you'll get is locked down and then weapon metal. And then the rest of it is just like static that comes from her mouth. Uh, Gallifrey, give me an Arcana check. Or, and anybody proficient in religion, you can give me a check as well. The DC is lowered because of uh, Don's uh, legend lore. Nice. 26. Damn. Gallifrey, there is a divine essence that is protecting this information. A divine will, not essence, but a divine will protecting this information. Hmm. I do a backflip. <laughs> okay, you. Yeah, you tumble yes, backwards, James. floating in space with ease. All right. Uh... Any other questions that you would like to ask the weave itself? Would you allow my question to be asked again now that we have legend lore going on? Or is that a one-use thing? Um, with legend lore, I will allow it. Just I mean, I would question. kindly ask. I would kindly ask Gallifrey. You're better at this than me, brains. Would you mind asking if we have two smite users here? Will this? Are, are we going to be completely useless? Will radiant damage be completely ineffectual? Okay. Gallifrey, um, if you want to aid in the re-asking of this question. If you would be willing. I'll ask uh, in my head, since this is a mental connection, yes? Okay. Uh, yeah. Will my star strike true? Will my star strike true? Yeah, give me another Arcana check. Uh... Can I help him since I'm the one asking him this? Uh, yes, I will say that you can assist. And I, I guess, would you count me as concentrating legend lore, or is that that's not a concentration, right? I don't think so. No, it lasts for ten minutes. Okay. If not, then can I give him guidance? Sure. Take uh, roll guidance. again, Gal. Roll again. And yeah, add a, a D4. You. And add a D4 to it. Okay. <laughs> Woo! 20, all right. <laughs> that works. 32. <laughs> Beautiful. All right. So. What's his family life like? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, what's his. So be. Our social security number. <laughs> <laughs> so get the back of the credit card. Since you have beaten the uh, highest listed DC in the Dungeon Master's Guide, this allows you to achieve something impossible. So, 
not only will the knowledge in your mind, Gallifrey, into your head that the foe that you are about to face is immune to necrotic and radiant damage. Oh. Yay. You can ask to reveal what that div- which po- which half the divine will of a weakness was trying to conceal. Bad game to roll a paladin. Which half? Yes. So the first half was two words, locked down, oh. and the second words were metal weapon. Uh, we'll go with the metal weapon. Okay. They are weak to a weapon made of adamantium metal. You would learn that they are vulnerable to a weapon made out of adamantium. Anyone brought a adamantium sword? Nope. I brought my fists. <laughs> I brought a serpent's fang. I was so close to asking you for an adamantium long sword, but I thought it was too broken and you wouldn't allow it. <laughs> I hate myself right now. It's okay, it's okay. Now we know. We'll keep an eye out for adamantium. Spell slots uh, aren't for smites, I guess. I'll communicate my uh, insight to the members here. Uh, okay. Meanwhile, is it worth just yelling to like every all the other priests around? Hey, I don't want to have like an adamantium weapon in this chapel, real quick. <laughs> Someone picks up a walking cane, just tosses it. This says one to four out of bad time. <laughs> Any other questions? Well, I will predator say- handshake Gallifrey and say thank you. Um, would you would you say that I I gave up my slot to cast Legend Lore? Yes. Okay. Nagy gave up his slot to do a backflip. Okay. <laughs> Two key <laughs> points for the flip. But DM, yeah, but... as people are asking, would you still allow me since I did give up my question to pat my uh, dear newlywed husband on the arm and? Give him advantage on his next initiative. Drash already uh, has, like, an, yeah, has a has, blessing. He already I has have advantage. advantage. Oh, He's, could I yeah. get it? <laughs> Never mind. Yes, I will give it to you. Yeah. Okay. You got it. Let's right. go then. Let's see if we can find some adamantium line shit on the way. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Uh, Myth, is this also serving as our pre-battle stuff? Yes, this is. If any bots you want to cast while about okay. to travel through the magic of plane shift, do so uh, right now. Also, do you want to ask the? Why do you think I got married right now? <laughs> yeah, I made it as an RP thing that I will only buff during combat. Yeah. Sure. Also, do you want? Does somebody want to ask the weave for an adamantium weapon? I will, I guess. I will too. Uh, well, I'll Can say, someone help me? I'll say, Baton Man, you've already asked, so I think, I think we're, I think at this point you're kind of out of time. Um, I'll say that you're that you've you've come to your limit of questions before everybody's brother about asked for two. <laughs> yeah, you guys. Gary <laughs> Pasco. Yeah, you guys. Yeah, so uh, <laughs> you guys watch as um, Lucius. <laughs> vanishes through the plane ship spell. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, who's asking for an adamantium weapon? I can't, right? Because I'm casting the weapon. Control. As Control. you ask, uh, before, beforehand, Nagy will give you some key. Here, let me give you some key. I'll help you out. <laughs> Yippee, Esther. Uh, <laughs> hey, 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 I haven't done anything, sorry. <laughs> All right. Contrell, you can give me a, um, uh, your paladin. Okay, so you can give me either a, sp- oh boy, 
Yeah, I'll say you can either give me a spell casting check or an arcana check. The DC you have to beat, thanks to legend lore, is a 13. You have guidance. Could I ask for a not a bad time? Uh, well, James, I'll buy you dinner. You're guiding somebody. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Unless you want to resend your guidance and use your question. No, use your question. I, no, he would do that. No, he would do that. Okay. Because right now he doesn't really understand all this, so I, I think it would make sense for him to just be helping out. Let's see. Um, you said Arcana? Arcana. Or spellcasting check. Your choice. Which would be a Christmas. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Wait, hold on. What? Hold on. Do I, do I have... Shit, I don't you know. Got you, got you got anything. You got anything. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. Shit, I didn't take Lucky. I took... While Don's looking, uh, Calvary's staff will glow. He'll touch his arm and then his other arm, casting Longstrider and True Seeing on himself. Okay. Yeah, yeah. and Lucius, yeah, just sorry. before he jumps through, chugs his potion of invulnerability and casts Haste on himself. Okay, cool. Y'all took such good items. All right. So, magic shield, and there is a hasted condition here. There it is. It's a shoe. Yeah, it's a shoe with the wing, yeah. All right. Unfortunately, Contrell, as you place your knowledge and your will into the magic that is flowing through you, you just feel... Uh, not deniance necessarily, but you like reach out with your will and just the magic just does not respond, unfortunately. Can I try? Uh, yeah, you got a question. I just want to ask for an anti mantine weapon. Okay. Let's see, you're a. Well, you're a conglomerate of many things, so you can either give me <laughs> uh, an Arcana check, a Wisdom check, or a Charisma check. I'll do a Wisdom check. Okay. And um, I can't give Guidance anymore, can I? Yeah, I'll allow Guidance. Okay, here's Guidance Oh, that's awesome, bro. <laughs> Thank you, bro. That's mm -hmm. awesome. Oh! <laughs> do right. the D4, do the D4. Oh yeah, I, uh, it beats it. Well, oh, yeah. I know, but maybe there's oh, more stuff. We don't know. I'm asking for a quarter staff. Eighteen is just the DC you needed to oh. meet. <laughs> Let's fucking go. <laughs> so adamantium quarter staff, yeah. quarter staff. Okay, you got it. How does he pull it out? Just like out of his ear. That's up to you. Uh, you see, Negi will just like after he fails, he'll put some key like in the air, and then like with the like, the magical energy, it, like enhances his key, and then he just like summons forth like a uh, a red pull. Oh, nice, <laughs> bro! If it's out of your ear, that's in in line with the Sumo call mythology. <laughs> <laughs> no, I know. Uh, he's not entirely based on Goku. Come on, there's some originality. <laughs> <I know. laughs> some originality. Okay. Uh, okay hey, so... uh, look, I got this quarter staff. You want to use it? Looks, looks to Kendrill. <laughs> well, not really my kind of weapon. But it is handy. Uh, I already have a weapon. I just want to pull out. I just want to try. Nah, I think I'm good. All right. We'll just keep an eye for adamantium. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah, because you're going to be fighting something that's invulnerable that is vulnerable to adamantium in an adamantium mine. Yep. We don't know that. <laughs> <laughs> Superman is hanging out with his kryptonite. <laughs> yeah. yeah hey. Superman is just living in the kryptonite mine. On yeah, yeah, All right. I yeah, am. Yeah. I am. My body is ready. Yeah, you go to fight Superman, and he's just like, hey, I've got a volleyball-sized uh, piece of kryptonite. You just want to toss it around? <laughs> That's <laughs> not the first time he's accidentally <laughs> fought in presence of kryptonite, though. Yeah, but that's like railroading in comics. 
That's true. Well, maybe maybe he's garbage. Garbage. Comic stories are dumb. All right. Maybe he's garbage right. keeping it away from his enemies. Anyway. Right. If there are Moving on. no other questions, I think everybody except for <laughs> maybe Zrash has asked, their, asked a couple of questions at this point. Uh, uh, okay. I, I, I'm going to say, can I get a weapon from one of the other guys? An like, adamantine ask... weapon? Yeah, so like, can I get like a sword from one of you these guys? You want the staff? Like, can I Here. try to summon up one, just to be nice? Well, you haven't asked a question, so yes, you can. So you are, let's see, you're a barbarian. Um, I just want to be able to kill good. Uh, <laughs> I guess as a barbarian, again, Arcana check is always allowed, but I suppose you can do, I think the closest of like using just the, we'll say like the energy and willpower of your body. So but give me, you can give me a constitution check if you'd like. Ooh. Ah, okay. With guidance? Rare With constitution guidance. check. With guidance. The rare constitution check. All right, cool. Throw that out. Wow. Nope. Oh. <laughs> no, roll the guidance, roll the guidance, roll the guidance. Yeah, um, okay, that's a D, yeah, you a... said a D4, right? Yeah, it, D4. It's a, it's a DC 18. <laughs> yeah. Oh, fuck me. Okay, never mind. <laughs> oh, well then. You got it. Well, one last thing then, DM. Would you let me use my divine intervention to get somebody or two somebody's? Absolutely. Roll <laughs> for it. Go for it. You oh, want to see man. your divine intervention now? It's when am I going? I mean. When am I going to do it? Otherwise, I my god is the <gasps> god of. I was going to say it was the matron of ravens. Oh shit. Yeah, so when am I else am I going to use it? Is my is the oh. thing, right? Oh, wait. Okay, wait, that's it. Okay. Okay, <laughs> okay. I need to roll percentile die. How do I roll a percentile die, DM? Uh, at the bottom right of the chat. Yep. Yes. You have to get a 16 or under. Is it like a 1d100 or? 1d100. Yeah. Little yep. dice together. You just click okay. them once. Uh, do they have like a... Uh, Oh, oh yeah. nope. That'll didn't be an work. 87. Yep. So. You have advantage from Raven Queen. No, Thrash, <laughs> summing the pure will, power, and strength of your entire might. You demand the weave give you an adamantine weapon, and it refuses. <laughs> <laughs> well, you chuckle fuckers are screwed. Uh, Don, you, you know, weirdly, this fits with the story. You reach out towards your divinity, <laughs> your matron of wavens, and you feel Waven. an absence. Wavens. 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 You're waven, uh, and you feel an absence. <laughs> That's so waven. And there's no response to your call. But, in any case, I am going to say that that is the extent of the things that you guys can ask and ask for. Okay. So we, uh, just to kind of get things moving along a little bit here. <laughs> in, a, uh -huh, uh, in a story, and, and one way, more. can I do something? <laughs> Sorry, go. Sorry, one more thing. Could you make my, uh, the Adamantine Quarterstaff monk weapon for me? Oh, right. Um, for dexterity, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay, one second. All right, thank you. Sorry, that, that, that's a little important. <laughs> no, I got you. I have a total of four quarter staffs on me now. <laughs> wow. Right. So you have a full staff? Of staffs? Yeah. yeah. All right. Can everybody see the map? I can. Yep. Indeed. Yep. It is very it's black. yellow and blue. Oh, well, okay, it's black. It's black for you? Okay. Yeah, and I should have night vision, so. I mean, I don't think you'll need it. No, yeah, the space is. Bright. Yeah, the space is very lit up. Um. Right, Dawn? It says you're loaded in. Alright, let me check your token real quick. Do, 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 do. Vision enabled. Your vision rage is 300. Jesus Christ. Ooh, wow. <laughs> uh, glow anime. Oh. Let me, let me, let me read refresh. Maybe that's it. Yeah, if, if you continue to have problems, I may have to remove a very fancy aspect of this map. We'll find out. Fun 
don't know how to guess. Um, give me one second. Yes, it loads. A celestial gate, apparently. Oh no. Yeah, mm. nope. Uh, completely black. Still black? Yeah. Okay, let me rejag your token. Still black? Yeah. Hmm. Okay. No worries. It'll be less fancy than normal. Do, do, do. I wonder what it is. I'll tell you after the session. Uh oh. Does it have to be? Okay. Never mind. Okay. One second, guys. I was prepared for this. We're just like <laughs> through the portal, like, hold on. Yeah, so instead, doo -doo -doo, I will have to do this. Ooh, good thing I checked on that. Boop. Okay. Oh, God. Of course, I say I'm prepared for that, and then I start, like, immediately fucking thing up, things up. Perfect. I'm so good at this. There we go. We believe in you, DM. Thank you. Let's go, Myth. I appreciate it. <laughs> I appreciate everybody's support. DM, 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 DM. Chopping no. mushrooms. I should not do this with a knife. Now Foundry's being Foundry. Okay. Oh, I can't believe it's not perfect. This looks real cool, though. Also, yeah. just like, I heard somebody do like the, how do you want to do this? How do you want to do the thing? A Critical Role fan? I am. I am. I am. Yeah. I'm yeah. just, and I'm also very much up to date. I watched the latest episode of Ravening War yesterday, and by yeah. God, that's a great series. How do Critical Role separated? Okay. No! Oh. Rude! <laughs> Do you allow this type of slander in your home, Mithrin? Well, okay. Listen, well, everybody here's the thing, though. Can have I, will, their I will. Well, I will also say, like, maybe people around him have been like hyping up so much he thinks it's not overrated. But for someone who like came in without knowing, it's not. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we can all have our opinions, and we all love each other nonetheless. I hate you for having a different opinion. I can't believe it. Well, not I mean, are you, are made do you equal. like Dimension 20, at least? I don't watch them. Love oh, Dimension they're great 20. as well. All right. Can everybody Brendan, see Brendan this Lee. map? Yeah. Yep. I can see it still. I, can, I still can't see it. I don't know what's wrong. What the we're hell? The map. Yeah, I, I see everyone else, map. but I, I can't see, like, people. Oh, no, I can see people. I just can't see everything around you. I see everything. I see Firefox, too, so... Oh, see everything, so. yeah. Foundry doesn't always like Firefox. It doesn't like my, uh, it doesn't like my, what's it called? Uh, Chrome either. It should like Chrome. Chrome usually works better, yeah. Yeah. Let me, uh, okay, let me try Chrome. Let me try Chrome. Is, is your hardware acceleration enabled? How do I check if my hardware acceleration is enabled? Uh, you go into settings. Oh god, I don't think I have Chrome on my computer anymore. Can somebody tell tell them how to go Hold to Hold on. Let, let me let me go let me try and go into Chrome first. Maybe that'll solve it. Okay. Sorry guys. No worries. It's uh, no worries. Uh while we're waiting for that, why doesn't everybody get, uh roll in uh, yeah. Yes. Roll initiative. Roll, roll initiative. initiative. Let's get it. Real easy. You, you... You click the settings and then you search acceleration. Yeah, there you Chrome, go. I don't see anybody. On Chrome, I don't see anybody. You don't see anybody. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Maybe it's my fault on my end. It's Is it? Dumb. Do you have dynamic lighting for like different um, stairs and shit? And shit or? Not on this one. There's no there's no dynamic lighting on this one. Okay, I don't know what that would be then. Because that's the only time like in my usual campaign that would fuck up, but weird. 
Yeah, tell sorry guys, I don't know what's wrong. Tell me when what's you can see something. Yeah, definitely check hardware acceleration. Give me one sec, I'm going back to Firefox because at least I could see people. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Actually, I mean, I'm on a... Chrome, it's never given me an issue. There's a gem right there, I'll just place you guys around that gem. We'll say that gl gem glowed with the same silver light that Zaya was commanding and you, <laughs> you guys appeared out of it. That's fun. It kind of looks like, you know, like a space portal, if you look at it. Like it's... Yeah. Honestly, it reminds me of Honkai Star Rail. I've been playing that recently. It's like the uh, dimension shit from there. Mm. Yeah, I only see. I only I see people. I can't see anything else. You only see what? I only see the people. I don't see everything else is black. That makes no sense. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna delete your token. Uh oh. <laughs> and I'm going to re-import your character. Foundry being Foundry. Here we go. I love that we're kind of in formation, in formation with the wizard at the tip. <laughs> yeah, that sounds so promising. Yeah, within reason, you guys can kind of position yourselves where you think you would have liked to appear. It's like Fine. within this platform. Yeah, uh, kind of like around the crystal you f -f 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 appeared out of. That little little purple thing in the ground. Well, Alex is a game DM, so you can... Okay, so hovered by anyone. You did see the other maps, didn't you? I did. Uh, yeah, yeah, they did. No owner. Okay. Well, the other ones weren't maps. It was um back. Oh, just an image. Yeah. Okay. Please. Yeah, no, it's still blackness. I don't know what's wrong. Oh shoot, more blackness. Hmm. <laughs> <sighs> Please hold. Please hold. <laughs> yeah. Come on. Is it because I have light source animation and uh, zoom texture analyzing and everything checked or I was gonna say try on your end just turning things down maybe turning things off turning things down anything at this point okay yeah um okay why didn't that hold on I don't own any token with a vision in the scene we <laughs> can you just imagine as we can shut down you just see the Alec go whoop we <laughs> just like yeah. ping ponging <laughs> in and out. Uh, That's funny. Anything? Complete darkness now. Complete dark. Okay, 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 okay. At least it changed. Anything? That's true. I'm, I'm just gonna refresh and see. I will be right because back. Of it. Okay, go. Worst for comes it. to worst. Worst comes to worst. Just if if someone can just um uh what's it called? Screen share. Uh, screen share. I'll I'll just look at that. Okay. I will try, yeah. but my internet might get funky. Well, someone else would do it. Yeah. You'll see. G I was gonna say you'll see GM stuff. So if somebody else could do it, that'd be great. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I don't want to see GM stuff. Um, maybe disable disable game canvas. Mm, yeah, you can give that a try if that's on your end. Some secure computer is loading. Oh, it's loading. That's it. I'm gonna punch Foundry so hard. But go back to the foundations of the earth. <laughs> Almost like it's a foundry or something. Hey! hey! That worked? No, I think they were. See. I think they were celebrating the joke. Yeah. Uh... No, celebrating joke. No, that's it. Doesn't work at all. Um. Yeah, I think. 
I'll, I'll still like play around the settings, but um, if someone could um, live stream it, I Ooh. think that's the only way I can. Try Control oh. F5. Clear your cache. Sometimes Foundry has I'm weird cache stuff, caching stuff that goes. I'm on. on a Mac. Is that the same thing? I have no idea from Max. I couldn't tell you when it comes to Max. Oh boy. <laughs> are you on? Are you still on Mozilla? Uh, I'm still on yeah Firefox because when okay. I went on um, oh. Hey, he's back. Yeah, so sorry, someone called me on Discord. Good. I think you just go on privacy and security and just cookies and site, whatever, clear data. Yeah, or can or command F five maybe. Privacy. No, Come shoot. On. No, stop. Stop. No, stop. No, no, stop it. No, stop voiceover. Oh god. Yeah, because um, command F five is voiceover, yeah. Um, oh God, I don't want to. I don't want to hold us up. In that case, you know what? Like, let's just let. I'll just go through somebody's um share screen if that's fine, because I don't okay. want to hold anyone up. My internet is kind of shoddy. Anybody? Let's see. Um, I guess oh. I can try. Hold on. You know what screen I can share? I have a second monitor where I have the game Ooh. up. Ooh. Let's go! I forgot I'm about that. I'm an idiot. That. Yeah, I forgot about that too. I Here I am. I'm like, it's brand new, so I don't always remember it. Okay. Go ahead and give that a watch. Okay. You shouldn't be... Yeah, you shouldn't see any uh, GM stuff while by nope, watching I that. Nope, I see a beautiful, gorgeous white and crystals. Everything's going on. Yes. Beautiful. Yes. You will. Yeah. Yeah. Cool, cool, cool. All right. We figured it out. Woo! <laughs> Let's play the game. I'm gonna edit all that out. <laughs> welcome back, YouTube. Yeah. Dear, yeah, welcome viewer. back YouTube. Dear viewer. This is this is this is everything that happens in reality. <laughs> oh, okay. Yes. Online online D D. Unfortunately. All right. So, as you guys feel <laughs> gravity once again take over your bodies, and you hover above this. Oh, well, I have an, an entire description for this. Let me read that, actually. I wrote it down. Might as well read it. Uh, Probably a good idea. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. As you guys vanish from the Temple of the Raven Queen, you begin flying down this tunnel of stars or river or stream. It's all kind of one. And you watch as planes pass by you like comets with just, just a trail of fire behind them. You strain to look forward, and as you do, you see a window, circular window into a plain filled with blue sky and pure clouds. A great platform or contraption, you're not entirely sure, floats amongst them. And as you all <laughs> emerge out of this kind of central crystal or swirling element of magic on this platform as Zariah's magic brings you directly to the Raven Queen's enemy. As you all kind of gather your bearings, you see several kind of floating crystals above these golden platforms uh, arrayed around you, arrayed. You also see two sets of stairs, and as you look forward, which, you know, might grab your attention a little bit more, especially with those of you with great eyesight, you will see this humanoid form. And as you kind of, like, peer closely at it, you see two pitch-black wings spread behind their back, with one difference from Zariah's shadowed wings that you saw unfurled from her. These ones are engulfed in golden flame with some slight elements of kind of this golden smoke flowing off of them. But what you think you see is a golden skinned oh, tiefling with two bull like horns, tips affixed um, with ornate gold spikes, and just this blackened, immaculate armor across her body. She's cool as hell, man. 
Thanks. <laughs> Luke, and, uh, one one question I do have is, um, I do have a twenty five passive perception. Do I see anything else like of like interest, like maybe like just on like her weapon or things like that? Do you see James? What, James, what's going on with your mic? Twenty five. Yeah, you did turn very muffled for us all of a sudden. Um, oh, sorry, sorry. I'll fix that soon. No, you're good. Uh, with, I'll say with your 25 perception, as you kind of glean some extra details. Like. Um, no, I'll say with a 25, that's more than enough. Because uh, I would normally, I would ask you, you can use your 25 or you can choose the roll, but 25 is more than enough. You see, in uh, as she turns to react to your guys' arrival, she unsheathes this silvery longsword, and down the center of it are these already kind of glowing golden runes. And as she does so, the blade itself kind of alights with a familiar black and gold fire. At least familiar in description. Um, and you also see this very tall kite shield, nearly as tall as she is. And as she kind of turns towards you, there is a skull in the center of it with a raven that kind of encompasses uh, with its wings around the skull. And the two sockets of the skull light up with golden light, very similar to her glowing gold irises. Zrash just kind of like points at her and goes, well, I think that's it. <laughs> uh, Don, why don't you roll initiative for us, please? I will do so. I'll do it in, um... If, if I can do the D&D &D Beyond, is that okay? Yeah, absolutely. If, you, if you've you got the Beyond 20 extension, you can roll in all kinds of stuff. And they'll show up. Natural Otherwise... fucking 20 for a 22. Ooh, yeah. All right, damn. That's two natural let's, 20s. Yeah, let's get it. Uh, and, and they still both rolled under the wizard. Yep, and, <laughs> and wow. confirming in the uh, shared campaign roles in D&D Beyond, that is correct. Um, I don't know why it didn't come over to Foundry, but we're not going to worry about that. Uh, mm -hmm. All right, so you come in with a 22, Don. Hell yeah. Thank you. Like, look up to them and scream out, you, come on. Maybe you want to talk this out. We don't want to resort to everything to violence. Violence isn't always the answer, you know? But, you know, we... We can talk things out, right? <laughs> she... <laughs> responds... With a very... Confident smile on her face. And you can see the rows of sharp... Tiefling teeth. Oh, shit, that's Pandora. And... No shit. <laughs> uh... And she says, No talking. Mother Death would like to prove her power. I... I think we could all be friends, but if it's a fight you want, I won't refuse. Oh, it's a fight that I insist on. And she licks her blackened lips. Absolutely not. This is not the Goddess of Death. That's so rude. I can't believe it. Wow, you're rude! All right. All right, then. If that's what you want, then a fight is what you'll get. <laughs> but to be warned, I do not know how to, I don't know how to hold back. <laughs> GT, Dragon Ball GT. She... I thought you said this wasn't a, a complete. <laughs> her, her, her smile gets wider and she says, I don't know how either. Good. I want a with, real challenge. With Can we that, just beat the shit out of her? Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> with that, the wings will almost seem to get larger, the flames more intense, and she will float about a foot off the ground, seeming intent to <laughs> jettison her way in your guys' direction, which will start the first round of combat with Gallifrey. Sure. I'll start by casting haste and beginning a blade song in a little twirl. Let's go. Uh, does haste give me an extra action this turn? It sure mm. does. 
It's a good question. I actually want to answer that for myself. I don't use haste very often. I probably should. Uh, yes, on each of its turns. Okay. Uh, then I'll drink a potion of heroism for my object interaction. Okay. That's me. Actually, I'll kind of shift over this way a bit. With my Lots of buffs. 40 movement speed. Can I move? Oh. You only have 20 movement speed, base? I have. No, that yes. was my normal movement. Yeah, this is 40. This is normal movement. And you have twice from haste, right? Oh, I forgot. Oh, no, it's just plus 10. Or no. Oh, no, yeah, it's double. double. It's double so with speedy. haste. You have yeah. double from haste and, and plus 10 from bladesong. Oh, God. Good God. You it's can haul ass. Yeah, it's yeah, been a while feet. since I played Gallivray. I feel It's been a while! Uh, <laughs> it's been so a while! I'm going to 50 so I can go 100. Yep. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Seems good, you know. Probably gonna fly around, but whatever. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna add my buffs and then I'm done. Okay, you got it. Let's see. As a legendary action, she is going to use Fleet of Flight. she will fly sixty five feet right about there and definitely sixty five feet up so for our players who haven't played under me before I do not do the uh, Pythagorean and theorem or whatever yeah theorem whatever it's called so diagonal oh. wise doesn't uh, impede on your movement at all no a squared cool. plus b squared equals c squared none <gasps> of that none of that I don't like doing math <laughs> I like Simplify. my I like good. my BGT to do as much of my math as I want <laughs> so <laughs> all good there all right uh, that'll be a legendary action bringing us to Zrash the Mighty uh, all right, so let's see here. What to do first? Hmm. So, since she's flying, the rash is actually going to roar and then do gem flight. Hell yeah. So, as the rash is like roaring at her, giant spectral wings like just spl like immediately splay out of his back, kind of really pretty looking. Ooh, nice I'm use of say this. Yeah. And he is then going to go uh, start heading straight towards her while climbing. Okay, you got it. Climbing the air? Yes, climbing the air like he's on the ladder. Do, 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 do. No. Uh, cool. Cool. Is that as far as you would like to move? Uh... I'm going to do uh, a held action in case uh, she gets close to me. Uh, I'm going to start swinging. Okay, you got it. Since I do need a bonus action to rage, and that was my flying was my bonus. All right. Is that the end of your turn? Uh, yeah, I think I will. Hey, Don, you can, you can still see stuff? Uh, yes, what is your question after Don answers? Wait, what? Don, you can still see stuff? Uh, I'm I'm just looking at the um, uh, yeah, I'm just looking at the Discord. Okay, cool. Just as long as you can see on the Discord. All right, what is your question, yeah. Gallifrey? Uh, now that she's within my true sight, do I identify anything new? Uh, that's like illusions and stuff like that, correct? Um, if it's true sight, I think it's everything, right? Yeah, it's, it's everything. It's into the ethereal plane. It's any illusions. It's uh, just not tremor sense. To normal magical darkness, no creatures in objects. There's no invisible objects, no invisible creatures that you can see. Uh, you don't see any illusions on them. Uh, they are in their original form. 
Uh, they are not transformed by magic. Okie dokie. So what we see is what we get, huh? What you see is what you get. It's like Britney Spears song. Since there is nothing to communicate, <laughs> I will communicate nothing. Okay. <laughs> okay. Very sick. All right. So Zrash, you hold your action. Uh, she is going to use a legendary action to cast a spell. Yep. I am going to say. Yeah, power word Am kill. I still flying? <laughs> well, no, shoot, you don't do. Never mind. Um, she is going to cast. Yeah, she. So, unless anybody is counterspelling. Not in range. Not in range. Okay. Oh. You got Sorry, it. Fun. You guys are going to see blades of. Fl uh, black flaming obsidian <laughs> appear all around her as she casts spirit oh, guardians. Oh, oh, that's good. That's good. She sucks. What do you? Cool. Right. Well, I know we have the spell bots in this party. That is going to we be. Also have concentration bots. Uh, that's your second legendary action, bringing us to dawn. Um, as my action, I'm going to invoke my, um, ba, 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 what is it called? Channel Divinity and Twilight Sanctuary. So everybody within a 30 foot radius of me is going to get 1d6 plus 16 temper hit points Ooh. when they end their turn in it. I'll... And just to make sure, go on. Oh, go ahead. Sorry. I'm going to make sure I move forward just a little bit, like to like, um, uh, uh, yay. Oh, no, shoot. How do I? Uh, to like, yay. I guess for some reason I can see like the spell effect for some reason. Like, like over here ish, if that's okay. So I can yeah. hit everyone if I can. Okay. Do you want uh, looks like the only person you'll be missing is Kentrel. Yeah, but they have to end their turn in it. That's why. So. Like, oh. I'm going a little bit forward, so it gives you some more options. Um, so that's my action. I can't do much with my bonus action. Um, but I will take out my heavy crossbow and just, like, have it at the ready. Okay. And just, if you ever seen, a, like, an owl, be like, <laughs> you know, like, puffing themselves up, that's me. Yes. <laughs> the incredibly ruffled, how dare you? Look, the uh, out, this yeah. is an uh, this is a this is an aura, correct? That just persists. Yep. What color would you like? I mean, make it purple. Mega purple. That's a good question. That's a great answer. Purple. My favorite purple. answer. Almost every color. It's it's almost like you're biased against that color. Yep. <laughs> Bitches, <laughs> I'm in like the BTS army, and our color is purple, and it's our month right now. So. Hell yeah. Pride month. Uh, BTS Army Month as well, so. Oh. Yeah. What does that even mean? The the K-pop band BTS, you know? Oh, they have sorry. a thing with purple, and don't worry about it. I I appreciate the K-pop. I'm just not educated in names. <laughs> yeah, educate <laughs> don't worry yourself, about it. buddy. <laughs> no, I mean, I mean, BTS Army boy. for life. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yee. When Tra Travis has mentioned them twice now, and I'm just like, ah! every single time he does. So that's all I do. <laughs> all right. Uh, that's your turn, Don? That's all I can do for now. Okay, you got it. That'll bring us to Neji. All right, he's going to stand back. I bet you want me on my full power, huh? Well, I'll show you that. <laughs> Ten minutes later. <laughs> but for everybody, no, first, like a your... season later. <laughs> but hey, what's your name before we begin this? Pandora, Truth. champion of death. That sounds really intimidating, and I like it. Name's name's Negi, champion of Kami. Let's do this. 
<laughs> oh god. <laughs> and you see him powering up. You see his muscles bulge out. Uh eh. You see his muscles bulge out. <laughs> <laughs> and then you see he starts to move a little bit faster and faster. <laughs> I'm not done. That's my turn. That's my turn. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> this this one does not exist. Jesus. <laughs> oh wait, you ended it. You ended my turn, right? So you would take the. I, I, yeah, I've um, already rolled that. Don't worry. <laughs> no, no, no. You take temp HP. Yeah, um, no, I already rolled the temp HP. Oh, you did? <laughs> yeah. Okay, nice. Is it plus sixteen? Yeah, yeah, it's a lot. Jesus, Twilight clerics. All right. <laughs> the end of your turn, Negi. It will be Pandora's turn. Change it for the question marks now. We know their name. Oh wait, I need to roll mine because it ended mine as well. Oh yeah, so, go ahead and roll yours as well. That's a twenty-one temp HP. Ooh, yeah. I is also it really one d six plus sixteen? Yes. It is. Yep. I insane. also have one hundred ten movement speed base right now. God damn! All right. But then... can you fly though? Yeah, but can you fly? I, I hope so. I mean, the DM doesn't do Pythag uh, Pythagoras' theorem, so it kind of renders the flight thing moot. Kind of, except wow. when it comes to like ranges of spells and stuff like that, you have to keep track of how high they are in the air. I mean, um, I'm in the air. I don't know if that makes a difference, but... Yeah. How far up in the air do you want to be? 30 feet. 30 feet? Uh, okay. Actually, yeah, yeah, 30 feet. Okay. 3 feet? Boop, boop, boop. There you go. Whee! We're cool. all at already different heights already. All right. So she is going to... Oh, she's already 15 feet above you, which is perfect. She'll get... She'll stay right there to keep you in her spirit guardians. Uh, and then Zrash, as she cocks her arm back, you see that golden flame across her sword get more intense. And as she swings it, there is this wave of that fire that comes off of the blade. Oh, lovely. So is that like a range? That they have yeah. a 50-foot range? Yes. It has okay, a... Okay, I just wanted to clarify. 30-foot range. Does a 26 hit? Uh, just barely. All right. Uh, you will take 15, 16. Unless you're resistant to anything, you will take... Looks like 20 points of damage. Unfortunately, I'm not resistant yet. Okay. So this wave goes out and explodes into Zrash, and he takes 20 points of damage. And they only rolled a nine. Wait, Zrash, you had the um, plus two AC, right? Yep. I have 22 AC at the moment. Ah, oh, damn. Okay. Yeah. She is going to take a second swing. Uh, 28 for yep. 21, 32 points of damage. Yep. As another wave <laughs> impacts into you. And as it does so, as the golden flames like dissipate, you see uh, like these obsidian blades emerge out of the fire and also impale you for the necrotic damage. Cool. You said 31? 31. Okay, cool. I am now below 200 health. Oh no. <laughs> Delightful. She is then going to spend a meta magic point. Oh shit. Oh, okay. And then she is going to point um her shield in the direction of everybody down here as she casts flame strike. Oh, that's fucked up. No, I don't know why I didn't expect us knowing Pandora. <laughs> it's like I, I know I know him. Oh, it's a deck save. I 
Yes, I will need Don I mean, and Lucius to make a dexterity oh. saving throw. I'm 30 feet in the air. Is this still impact me? That's tough. You're not oh. in the game. Flame Strike is a 40-foot high cylinder of fire. <laughs> cool. I cool, cool, hate cool, this, cool, even cool, though cool. I have a decent save. I'm not going to make this. Yeah, I don't make it. I take the full breath. Okay. So, Negi, you're going to take 21 points of fire damage and then 14 points of radiant. I have evasion. Is he in it? Ed, Negi, I'm not, you're in, not it, even in it. Oh, sorry, Lucius. I, I, I thought I was for yeah. some reason, but no, either you're... way, I got evasion, so. Am I resistant to radiant? No, I'm not. Oh, you... I am. I took my. I you took, took my your potion, potion of invulnerability. Of... Yeah, you took your potion of invulnerability, so you take half of that damage. So you take 10 points of fire and 7 points of radiant. 17 total. Are you doing HP or do you want us to do HP? Um, I can do it. I can okay. do it as well because I'm not fully there in the um thing. So yeah, I filled mine as well. I got a 10. Uh, okay, you got a 10. Got it. So you take same, the full dude. brunt. Mm -hmm. So 10 plus Which 7, 17. Uh, 21 and 14. Yeah. Oh, so oh. I only take 14. Technically, oh, Myth, I'm going to change mine to 156 because that would eat through my uh, 10 temp hit points. Okay. So that gives you back how much? Sorry. Just 10 hit points back. It Just goes from 146 points. to 156. I, I changed it. Oh, you already got it. Okay. Yeah. And you're immune to fire damage, Don? I'm not Im oh. I'm not, but I had temp HP already. Oh, that's right. Okay. Cool. That is going to be her turn. Yes, she wants to keep keeps her ash in the spirit garden. So that'll be her turn. That'll bring us to Kentrol. Okay. Um, we'll see. What type of damage has she been doing? Mostly? She's been doing slashing, radiant, and necrotic. Okay. And cool. fire. And random fire with fire strike. Yeah. I think uh, I think probably you should lock down Necrotic if you can. No, that's if exactly what I'm about to do. I'm moving yeah. up here. And I thought we cast R. No, wait, did I did I mistake that? Like somebody said they charged you on Necrotic and she was immune or He's immune to and... both Radiant and Necrotic. Yeah, they're they're immune to the, yeah, they're immune to both, but uh oh, if we can there. lock Sorry. down I, I Radiant's probably their like one of their main like damage dealing things. Yeah. So I think I mean I mean Necrotic, so I think locking that down would be uh, good for us. Okay. Technically, Ooh. that R should be coming from me, not on the ground. But um, R of life, you got it. Thirty foot sphere. That, that yeah. gives us a immunity to necrotic, right? Um, not immunity, but um, resistance. Oh, okay. Ooh. Yeah, I probably want to. You probably want to go in range of a uh, thrash then. What color do you want your R to be? Uh, let's say golden. Golden. I'll do my best. Gold is a hard color. <laughs> oh, okay. If not, then green. Kind so of. Get nice chromatic overlay. Yeah. By the way, as your turns are going on, Nike's just fucking screaming. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. All right. Anything I, else? I took to Ken. I, I I turned to Kendall and just like this is what you were like growing up. <laughs> All right, anything else? Mm, no, that's all I'm gonna do. Okay. You wanna move forward? Oh, you already yeah. did. Yeah. Okay, I'll get rid of that other one there. There we go. All right, uh, end of your turn. Legendary action. They are going to, they're going to look down at Zrash and you're gonna see the front of her face just turn into liquid gold and melt Wait, hold off. on. Siraj, did you check your temp HP yet? Uh, I hadn't because okay. I wasn't in range then. You're not? Well, no, you ended in my range, right? No, I was 40 feet up. And oh, she, well, I was out of the range. She now. was 30 feet. She was 30 feet up. So you get yeah. to heal. Roll a d6 plus 16 and we'll see how much you heal for. Okay. Not heal, temp HP. Well, he took the damage, the full brunt, so then we heal him the 16. Does that make sense? I think. I oh, I see what you mean. Yeah, yeah, no, it does, it does, sorry. Okay. Plus 16. Uh, 
God damn. Twenty-two. All right. Okay. So you heal for twenty-two points of damage. Cool. All right. <laughs> yes, uh, flavor. Uh, yeah. So her face is gonna turn to liquid gold and melt off, just revealing like the skull beneath with those same glowing gold irises, and she's just gonna unleash a scream at Zrash as told the dead. Cool. So make a wisdom saving throw for me, please, Rash. Wisdom saving throw. It's really good on the D12. And I think you have, I think you have it with advantage because of Heroes Feast, right? Uh, you would. Yeah, they do. Yeah, okay. That's a good fucking damage roll, though. The that thing is saver stuff. Oh, hard. you. Oh, you can't even pass. Oh, okay. I literally can't pass. Okay, yeah. Okay, that happens sometimes. Uh, so, Zrash, uh, you'll just feel your life essence, like, leave your body as the scream racks you for 35 points of necrotic damage. So, negative 35? Alright, and that'll bring us Are to... Are they in the aura of life? Lucius's turn. He is just oh, outside no. of it. Oh, okay. I need to rage. My turn needs to happen <laughs> now. <laughs> so why did it rage? Because <laughs> I needed to fly. That's fair. It's true. All right, Lucius, it is your turn. Bonus action. I will click my wing boots. Uh, blah, blah, where at? Here, they're here somewhere. Boom. Wing boots as my bonus action, I believe. Hell yeah. And then, do I have 60 feet of movement? I don't even need the full brunt of it to get to her. I will go right up and close to her at her level. At her level, you got it. I'll be right up face to face with her. Sorry. I do I want to do good. anything else before I, I do this? May I make a suggestion? Sure, James. Uh, I say stay out of the of the uh, spirit guardians for now. I mean, the thing is, out with with it, I'm useless. I literally have nothing else to do. I mean, yeah. I mean, you can catch I up mean, to them still, though, right? If you're like twenty feet away, and like, if you, if you can't hit them or anything, then you should probably. I can hit away. them. I have. Oh, if you can, I mean, I need to. I need to set up. I'm my okay. my sword is not radiant. Uh, uh, it's just that smite and everything else doesn't work, and I'm going to need at least a turn to set up, so... Yeah, okay. okay I'm going to need the next two turns to set up, so... First, yeah, I, I, I need make, to be up and close. Yeah, you know? first make a wisdom saving throw against the Spirit Guardian since you entered their space for the first time on your turn. Yeah. Yep. And I get advantage, advantage because of my... Oh, shit, that's... Spellguard hard. shield. Um... Uh, that's a, that that doesn't make it. Okay, so you will take seventeen points of necrotic damage as those floating Out to fl uh seventeen. That's half to eight. Yes, round down. Well, I round I'll down. do my math. Yeah, I'll do I my math. Down. Don't worry about it. Okay, so yeah, eight points of necrotic damage as those floating obsidian blades just <laughs> fly at you and slash into yeah. you. Yeah. If I only rolled above a ten. <laughs> Uh, I will take two slashes at her. Go for it. Long sword of sharpness, to... straight. It's not gonna you be great, but yeah, that doesn't hit. Twelve is gonna miss. Try that again. Second attack. That's oh. also a two. Wow. Twelve. Haste. Hasted action. That hits. Wait, That's a twenty-eight better. to hit. Twenty-eight Fif will hit. Fifteen slashing. Fifteen points of slashing damage. As she your... may roll concentration. Yep. As two of your strikes go out, she just lifts her tall kite shield, and they just re uh, bounce off with a shower of sparks. But the second one you stab past and get, like, through a weakness in her armor, and you do feel the blade connect. But what you feel underneath that is just this hardened force of enhanced flesh. Like, you could, like imagine stabbing Thor, and you will deal seven points of slashing damage. Ooh. Force? Uh, concentration, I guess. She might fail. Yeah. 
Um, I, I think they probably can't fail. That's my, that's what I'm thinking. Unless they have like 10 Burn those legendary resistances though. Yeah, uh, I mean, true. That's, what I, that's why I'm here. With her aura of protection, she literally cannot fail against seven points of damage. Yeah, I assume yeah, that's so. That's what I expected. Yeah. Okay. That's that me. Turn? That's all I can do. Okay. Action, bonus action. Roll the roll the temp HP. Yeah. Oh sure. What's the what's my math? One d six plus six plus. Well, how tall is it? Because you're sixty five feet in the air. Oh. She's forty feet. Up. She's thirty feet up. Oh, that's right. Okay, so you're, you're good. Okay. You're good. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're good. One d six plus sixteen. Yeah, twenty one. I get twenty one back. Perfect. Uh, at the end of your turn, she is going to use, yeah, she's going to use Fleet of Flight. Uh, Lucius, you can take an attack of opportunity if you so wish. I will. Please hit. Please hit. Yep, Please, for the love of all that it's holy. Well, I do have Sentinel, but 19 doesn't hit. 19 will miss she'll just take her as she turns to fly away she can somehow sense your attack and she immediately spins around with the blade and just parries it away from her as she like dives out of range of you she'll move this? she'll dive 30 feet uh oh you're playing smart yeah that's smart i have bomb and a burb can i have take oh no my turn's over you're right um, that's the legendary action, bringing us to Gallifrey. Right. Uh, you move back? Uh... Prince one <laughs> way, Prince back the other way. <laughs> I thought there was a way I could step this, but... You still have 100 feet. That's true. Which is insane. Man, if you had expeditious I retreat... I have base, bro. If you what had expeditious... Yeah, but, he, you... but he's a wizard. <laughs> he's a I'm wizard. Part of that uh, it'll tell you. Telling me. It should tell. Oh, it didn't tell you for some reason. Uh, I don't remember. <laughs> it looks well, like it looks like lighter. thirty. Looks like so... thirty. <laughs> uh, I can't reach. I'll just go. How big's your aura? Is it ten feet or fifteen feet? Paladin. Uh, f fifteen yeah. feet for the spirit guardians. Ten for paladin. paladin. Yeah. Yeah, 10 for Paladin. Uh, I'll just move like close to him. I know I got that much movement. Okay. Um, all right, so I will uh, cast a spell magic. Turning Ooh. Good move, yeah. At third level. Third Ball level? Path wizard. Yeah. Uh, all right. Yeah, very good move, yeah. Uh, all right. Oh, I do. Um, okay, just double checking. I have like a. <laughs> what level? He doesn't have counter spell. Him? No, she doesn't have counter spell. That's what I'm checking, actually. She doesn't. <laughs> she doesn't. I just know she doesn't. She doesn't. I know for a fact she doesn't. <laughs> I hacked you this morning. She doesn't. Building the suspense here. She's gonna counter spell. <laughs> <laughs> Only counter spell, counter spell. Okay. Um, you counter spell, counter spell easily enough. Mark off that uh, spell slot. You counter spell her counter spell as her Who's eyes kind of. Oh that? wait, hold on. Ooh, y'all would have to roll. Give they me. Have met... Oh shit, they have meta magic. Yeah, give me Contrell. Is that Contrell that wants to counter spell? Correct. Uh, yeah. Okay. With her superior casting feature, give me an insight check. Is it possible for yes. me to also make it since I'm nearby? 21. 21. I'm just going to roll one over on D&D Beyond. Okay. Hmm. 21 will not succeed. The what? counter spell oh. The counter spell goes past you without you being able to quickly react enough. I think the DC's 23. Yeah, it's your spell DC for everything, yeah. Yeah. That's cool. That's really cool. 
Okay. Uh, okay. Um, I don't care. So yeah, I'm just doing my next thing. All right. Uh, I take my uh, hasted attack. Uh, bonus action. I'll drink my other potion. Okay. You and got then it. Then I will use my hasted action to do an attack action, which will then be a cantrip of a firebolt. Okay. Twenty-four will hit, and that is going to be for fifteen points of damage because of her tiefling ancestry. She will take seven. Okay. That's everything I can do. Okay. End of your turn. Let's see, she did Fleet of Flight. Yeah, I think that's all she's done so far is Fleet of Flight. She will... She also did the Guardian thing during a turn two. No, that was the other one. That was, yeah, it was the last. First mission. This is round two, yeah. Okay. Yeah. This is round two? So, like, hit yeah. reset? Okay, I'm mm -hmm. sorry. Yes. Fuck me. Okay, never mind. All good. Um, she is going to yeah she's going to reach out and if anybody would like to try um and counterspell they can give me an insight check i think counter spells right now are just not worth it all right any clue what spell this might be you have no clue is it Circle of Fucking Death? Is that what it is? Also, did anyone end? No, no, okay, it's fine. I think I don't. Is Connor spelling worth it right now for us? Probably Inside not. Inside check it anyway. Inside check anyway. Yeah. If you don't, if you don't think it's worth yeah, it. Yeah. Is the inside checked at the cost of the spell slot and the reaction? No. The inside check is for free per the ability. As every time oh, I okay. inside yeah. check, even if I can't counter spell. <laughs> oh yeah, I guess everybody could give me an insight check. I'm okay sure. with that. That's yeah, that's not a pass. Oh. <laughs> Twenty six DM. Twenty six. Twenty seven for the Galley is rolling insane. Gallifrey, um, you watch as uh, behind, or, or she like, how do I put this? Her, oh yeah, this is what she does. She like lets go of her sword for a moment and just kind of hovers next to her. And then her hand turns into this uh, very quickly, like in the span of like microseconds, turns into this large claw of shadow. She tries to inflict wounds on uh, Dawn. Okay, that's not so bad, that's not so bad. Okay. So yeah. what level? You have resistance to the chronic also. Uh, it's not that bad. All right. <laughs> Wait, why do I have resistance to chronic? Aura, uh, aura of life. Oh, that's right. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Also, Galley, did you take your uh, temp? No. Sure, take but... Yeah. Remind yourself of your buffs. High level gameplay. <laughs> yep, that's why I'm here. I usually remember. <laughs> Yeah, for some reason, inflict wounds is not our sheet. Yeah, it is. Why isn't it showing? Okay, that's weird. Am I not seeing Does it? Does she need to roll to inflict wounds, right? Yeah, she rolls needs to, to roll hit. to hit. Yeah. Rolls to okay. hit. What'd she roll? She rolls. Bum, 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 25. Okay. Oh, okay. Pretty. Not a crit, right? Not a crit. Uh, oh. So, yeah, claws go out. <laughs> Uh, slash through you, uh, Dawn, for mm -hmm. half of 17 points of necrotic damage. Which is what? Nine? Eight? Eight. I think it's eight. Yeah, eight. It's eight. Yeah. I mean, eight was what you told me previously, so I'm just assuming myth. Yeah, yeah, you're I'm good. I'm pretty sure he rounds down. Yeah, I round down. Yeah. All right, that'll bring what us a gentle to... giant. That'll bring us to Zrash's turn. All right, Zrash, like, just midair, just, like, sw swings around, and goes into a rage. 
Also, you had a held action from when she came into range for you. Oh, no. That's her legendary action. Sorry. There are 15 people. They're 15 feet away, though. So Yeah, they were 15 feet oh, away. Oh, okay. No, I'm just, you know. Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah. And so now oh, I am right. I am now a... I am now immune to every. I'm not immune. Uh, resistance to everything. <laughs> that would've been funny. No, I, I, am I, am be nice. <laughs> I am now resistant to everything, and I am going to go and beat her fucking face. Okay. Uh, I will be uh, going down to her level, obviously, and then um, I'm going to recklessly attack. Uh, and do the uh. Great weapon master attack. Okay. Uh, it's, I'm not entirely sure exactly how to do that on this thing. Okay. Uh, you will shift for advantage. Uh, great weapon master will just do math in our own heads. You have to make a separate okay. button for it, typically. Okay. Just making sure before I started messing around with it. Yeah, you're good. All right. Uh, you do enter her space for the first time, so you'll need to give me a wisdom save as well. Yikes. Ooh, I mean, we don't know. Maybe twenty. Maybe twenty-one will do it. 21 with advantage, don't forget hero speed. Yeah, advantage oh, yeah, with wisdom save. Wisdom. Yeah, but they and remember, you can't you, you can't pass. Oh yeah, that's right. Uh, he can roll a nat twenty, I guess. Do you sure. allow automatic save on a nat twenty? I do not. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Should have just. You, you, you just. All right, just, that'll yeah, be let's just... five, <laughs> five points of necrotic damage to you as the Obsidian Blade slash into you, Zrash. Um, right. But a 21 will miss. I believe you have a second attack. I do. Let's oh, that's do also, that again. It's also minus five, so it's 16. Yeah. I, I, I think there is. Ooh. All right, yeah, there we go. 30, 25 to hit, yeah. 30 will certainly hit. 25 oh. to hit, technically. Okay, 25 just hits. So wow. she okay. will I like that. I like that. take 22, uh, halved to 11. She is resistant oh, a, to bludgeoning damage. And it's a weapon of certain death. She can't heal. She cannot heal. So I will put the... No, I'm not gonna put the dead one on her. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> I'll put diseased. There we go. And we'll be like, why is she diseased? I guess we'll find out. <laughs> <laughs> That's just to try and remind me that she can't heal um, until the start also, of your next turn. Also, question: Can she be frightened? You have no idea. You'd have to try. Uh, well, no. It li literally, uh, I have an ability uh, that she's affected if she uh, can't be frightened. Oh, uh, what's the ability? Uh, to, uh, Totematic Attunement Bear. Totematic Attunement. Why raging your hand fighting the hostile has disadvantage attack rolls against targets other than you or another creature with it? Oh, goddamn. An enemy immune to this effect can't see here. It can't be frightened. Oh, she's immune to it if she can't be frightened. You got it. Yeah. Uh, she is immune to being frightened. Okay. Obviously. Yeah, I mean, they're a paladin. <laughs> I figured, but I mean, hey. Anything else, Josh? What are her pronouns, by the way? Because we're floating between she and they, and I'm kind of confused. Oh, Pan <laughs> Pandora's a she. I use they as like a blanket okay. for for anybody's. Hey, what's your pronouns, know. Pandora? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this yeah. ass mid combat. No, she is. Randomly. Hey, will you? Uh, what do you I mean, want? I mean, I mean, we're trying to kill dinner each other, this? but we're not that rude. <laughs> dinner after this? Yeah, dinner it's after this. Dinner after this. No, I will rip your throat out. Uh, Zrash, is at the end of your turn? <laughs> yeah, this is every... Straight, so I'm straight into four... Straight into foreplay, the way I like it. <laughs> uh, Don, start of your turn. I will need a wisdom saving throw against the Spirit Guardians. Okay. Come on, Cleric! Is it 17? Wait, hold on. Do I have, like, a advantage on that? No, it's fine. Heroes, Heroes Feast. feast. Yeah, it's Feast. Okay. I will do it one more time. Heroes Feast. A nerd. It's a twenty. Oh. Ooh, twenty. Uh, unfortunately, does not save. So, uh, but I believe you're within the aura of vitality. Life. I think I am. Oh, I am too. Cool. We already. I mean, you are resistant anyway. So, do you quarter damage? 
No, yeah. the uh, I just remembered that the, the healing thing is still going on. The temporary hit oh, points. Oh, for sure. Oh, yeah, the temporary hit I points. Completely, I completely forgot about that. Thank you. Cool. So, Don, you will take five points of necrotic cool. damage. Okay. Cool. I do quarter. If you save against it, it will do quarter the damage. I. Cool. That will bring us to... Oh, no, that'll bring us to Don's turn. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, so this bitch is right in front of me. I do have a crossbow in my hand. DM, I have a question. If I have yes. a crossbow over my head and I drop the crossbow and grab my beak, would you count it as dropping a um, weapon? No. That's not fun. Fair. I also have two crossbows, so I never actually specify which crossbow I have. So can I choose which crossbow I drop? Uh, well, you don't drop anything. You just swap them. You can just swap freely. Oh, oh okay. Then in case, I will swap for my, um, Serpent's Fang. Okay. And, um, I'll, I'll stab a bitch. Stab a bitch. <laughs> All on oh, shit, the action. oh, shit, the cleric throwing hands. Oh, it's not good. It's 11. 11 will not hit, unfortunately. She's okay. well no armored. Hmm. Um, in that case, Bonus step, I'm going to Misty step away. Ooh, cool. Where would you like to go? Away. <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> still, be in a, still be in a decent range, please. Yes. Um, I can teleport up to 30 feet away from her. Um, so I'm going to go over here. That's okay. Yep, that's perfectly fine. As you <laughs> appear within that space. Yeah. Um, that's my bonus action. Just let me make sure. DM, if is it an action or just like a, a random thing, item interaction? If I try to ascertain the whole like vibe of the uh, crystals around me, I will allow a free arcana check. Okay. Let's see how it goes. Nope. Seven. Okay. No nine, idea. Nine. 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 No idea. Nine. <laughs> okay. Um, nine. Okay. Cool. Nine. Um, I'm going to also use my movement to get like slightly like. Hmm. Top right. Yeah. Maybe, be maybe be behind Negi or something like that. Yeah. Wait. Where's Negi? Sorry. Uh, I can't. right here. Uh, well, problem is that would put the Twilight Sanctuary way far from the action. That's true. Yeah, but y'all. I would. It's, it's, I would say you, top right, so she can hit us with area of effect. So at least we'll start yeah, spreading but, out. Yeah, let as her take long as you end your, as long as you end your thing within my uh, thing, that's fine. That's the whole thing. Okay. Um, oh no, I'm just suggesting. I'm sorry if it seems like I'm interposing. No, no, absolutely not. Um, I, you know what? I would just like. We just talk mm, a strategy. It's fine. Myth called me out, and I immediately felt self-conscious. I, I was about <laughs> to go, sorry. like, here, but I don't know if that would be a wise that's decision I think to that's, be amongst. I think that's... I, I think, think that's solid. Okay, I will. Manny, you're yeah. very quiet. What do you think? We'll be... I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I didn't mean to make you feel, make you feel self-conscious, conscious, by the way. Uh, and uh, I will have to pull my own, um... Because I, I am ending in my divine domain. Where'd you go? La la. Ba, 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 ba. Where'd you go? The fact that this basically puts us back at max after a turn of combat is insane. Twilight yeah. Clark's always insane, man. Mm -hmm. Jesus. We really need a hey, boss oh like God. this, though. Where do my thing about Manny, thing about Bob do? Manny, Manny, by the way, Ryzen is a, a Twilight Clark, so this shit is what we've been missing out on. Oh. 22! Yeah. Max Jesus. temp HP, let's go. Holy nice, nice. shit. Well, okay. well, well. Well, right. hail. What do we have here? <laughs> I definitely feel like this boss is a nuker, so we definitely need it. All right. Anything else with your, for your turn, Don? I don't think I can do anything else. Okay. Uh, that'll bring us to Negi. <laughs> and she... Uh, he powers up even more, growing more heroic, and Jesus Christ. and six charges on my staff of power, and you see massive blue key aura goes around him, 
<laughs> and I cast, uh, I don't know what this is, Globe of Invulnerability on myself. All right. Insight checks for anybody who wants to counterspell. What? Oh, this is from my she's staff of power. So, yeah, you, you can need to do that. Oh, <laughs> oh wow. Are they counterspelling me? That's like, uh, yikes. No, she's going to counterspell you. All right, so sixth. Nat 20. <laughs> Lucius. Uh, you see just a shimmer of energy begin to alight around her as her gaze looks down at Neji. And using her quickened mind, she'll use a second reaction. Yep, she's got another one. She's going to counterspell it. Mm. Okay. I'm actually completely fine with that. Okay. So she has to roll. Uh, it's DC 16. So it's yes. probably not going to be that hard. Yeah, she beats at 100%. Well, I, I mean, would say it's a check. Well, it is a check, so. Plus, say to charisma. Well, do, 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 we'll do. see. Oh. 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 Holy shit. Wow, Holy she, she fails. Interesting. Uh, so, um, yeah, but like, as like, they try to counterspell, you see the aura, you see like his like, his like, a uh, sad aura. And like, it just blocks it out. Beautiful. Just, and there, just there's... for the sake of myth, will you allow me to do something really quick? Yeah, what do you got? Um, I'm going to silvery barbs it nonetheless. Uh, Wait, why? Okay. She takes the lower roll regardless. Oh, so she's going to fail advantage. it anyway. Yes, I want the free advantage. Okay, that fits. That's, that makes sense. Oh, she... I see what you're doing. A little cheeky fucker. <laughs> She's gonna take the free advantage, and I'm gonna give it to myself. Thank you very much. Um, okay, I, I'm perfect. sorry to be a rules lawyer, but it says when you when a creature you can see within 60 feet succeeds on a saving throw. Oh, or oh should it succeeds? No, yeah. you're you're absolutely correct. No, you are correct. I'm sorry. I will retract. I will okay. use it later. Yeah, give back yourself mm -hmm. that spell slot. I can and because it's at will casting, but we'll just pretend I didn't use it. Okay. And Negi will he he can fly. Uh. By the way, so <laughs> you could fly, you could fly, you could zip up, <laughs> and uh, <sighs> all right, time to time to tango. It says I go in, but since it's the globe of invulnerability, the spirit guardians does not affect me. Mm -hmm. And now their counter spells will not affect me. Mm. Oh, because you're fucking inside the globe. That's kind of sick. What's well, Tango? Pandora, I'm... I don't know if I said my name. Name's Negi. Let's do this. You did. <laughs> I... Well, either way, why do this? Huh? For my Can't goddess. we all just be friends? For the mother. No. <laughs> no. Well, that's unfortunate. Maybe you'll change your mind after this fight. I there won't be much left of her after this fight. All right, uh, that'll be my turn. Oh, that's it. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't think you can attack. Yeah. All yeah. right. That yeah, is going to drag ball turn. So <laughs> to her turn. 14 uh, charges now. Okay. She's going to, uh, yeah, she's going to take a swing on Zrash. What? She has advantage, because I reckless. Uh, you're 30 feet up, so this can't hit you, Lucian. Wait. Oh. No, it can. Lucius? Yeah, she's gonna, yeah, she's going to angle this upwards. She's going to send a wave through oh, to the both this, of you. This 20, 29 to hit the both of you. Sure does. Seven. Three five. Okay. Seven three five. Okay. Uh, fourteen. Well, seven three five for him because he's raging. But fourteen six and for ten me too, for you. Oh, that's I right. Because you're of invulnerability. Potion yeah. and a vulnerability. She is. Yep. Fifteen total, right? Yeah. And then she is going to turn. 
that around. Oh God. Spin, spin for me. Why you no spin? All right, I'm gonna delete you and reproc you then. Fuck you. Pressing A <laughs> repeatedly. Yeah. <laughs> uh, she is then going to angle this down and hit. Oh, everyone. I'm gonna say no. I'm gonna say can't hit Negi because it's at an angle, right? And plus he's in the globe anyway. Uh, so that's Either gonna way, hit. That misses. Yeah, that's gonna hit Kentrol and Gallifrey, or try to with a twenty-two. Attack roll? Yes, 22 to hit. Miss. Ooh, you dodge out of the way. Um, so, Kentrel, if that hits you, that'll be 22 slashing and 17 more points. So, oh gosh, 39 points of damage. Uh, you okay. succeed your con save. Is the, sec is, is the second damage necrotic? Uh, yeah, or is it in the R gets half necrotic. Yep, first yeah. one is slashing, second one is radiance, and then necrotic. So yeah, five necrotic. Oh, okay then. Sweet, another wave. You said of... seventeen necrotic, so I wondered if that was like just a. Oh no, I combined radiant and necrotic, and then red necrotic. So my brain sure, was sure, like, sure, sure, sure. Yeah. Uh, I just wanted to make sure. I do have a question though. Yes. Uh, you know, since there was this to bludgeoning, would the uh adamantine quarterstaff just be normal damage? You have to find out. All right, then. And then she's going oh. to use another meta magic point. Jesus Christ. And she is going. She is going to do shouldn't take so long to decide these things she's yeah, gonna yeah. do yeah anybody wants to try and counter spell can give me an insight check 18 will fail doesn't hurt to try i guess i rolled it over that says, so yeah that says could... 25 wisdom uh, 25, no, that's an inside check. 25, that will succeed. Oh, she's casting Chain Lightning, yeah. Yeah. You see yeah, that probably. she just holds her sword down at, yeah, I guess the three of you. I am up in the air, though. Uh, I believe it connects to anybody within 30 feet. Yeah, Can just check. would. Three bolts then yeah, leap yeah. from that target to as many as three other targets, each of which must be within 30 feet of the first target. So she's going to target okay. Gallifrey, and then Kentrel, Gallifrey, and Don will need to make dexterity saving throws. DC 23. Oh. Yikes. And as that goes on, I, I didn't want to bother you on your turn, but er, could I use my... I, 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 could I use my free action check on something? I know it's a little bit late. I, I, I remember as soon as I ended, but I didn't want to bother... Yeah, just five? let's let's do the damage real quick. And yeah, yeah, can... I, I just wanted to make sure. Yeah. Cool. Gallifrey, you succeed. Control deck save. Uh, I'm trying to do it. Nice. I didn't see it. Did it pop up? I, I'm rolling over on D and D Beyond. Oh, There's I no see it now. Way. Okay, thirteen will not succeed. Uh, you failed as well. Okay, so everyone except for Gallifrey will take thirty-four points of lightning damage. Okay. Gallifrey, you will take sixteen. Reduced to eight. Reduced to so eight. So basically, only. Um, All right. And yeah. and then, if you would allow this, oh sorry, yeah. one. What do you got? Uh, if you would allow this, DM, may I make a perception check to see any weaknesses in the armor? Uh sure. Give me a perception check. That is a that's twenty. It's not enough. Okay, yeah. Can I do that on future turns? Yeah. Just like like you know, those like sensing weaknesses. Yeah. 
Absolutely. I mean, your passive probably beats it. Um, it is, I'm actively checking. It's not really. A oh, passive okay. Thing. No. Yeah, this, yeah. Is oh, okay. this is combat. This is combat. Has fair. to be an active check. No, make 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 makes total sense. Okay. Then yep. she is going to use the mobile feat to not take an attack, attack of opportunity from Zrash. She's uh, going I to fly Sentinel. away. Stop. Mobile, unfortunately, beats Sentinel. Okay, just making sure. You're all good. And then she's going to use her movement speed Whew. to get back over here. She sucks a little bit. End of a campaign boss fight. They're going to suck a little bit. <laughs> mm -hmm. And that is going to be her turn. Bringing us to Kentral. All right. Cool. Um, so I want to use Find Greater Steed to summon a Pegasus. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, but it does take 10 minutes. Oh, does it? It does. Mm. Let's see. Never mind. You know what? Because it's a one shot and there is a lot of magic shit going on here. Kentrell, as you oh, focus on most find wonderful. greater steed, <laughs> mostly because it's a one shot. Uh, you hear, do hear the beautiful, wondrous neighing from one of the clouds beneath the platform as your pegasus will alight. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> I you. wasn't confident enough to give it a go. <laughs> That's majestic as hell, man. Hell the yeah, brother. Flies speed is 90. Hell yeah. <laughs> I'll be Who right puts the back. gladiator? <laughs> I want to okay. fly over there. Oop. Oh god. Okay. There we go. Your little Pegasus buddy beneath your beneath your feet. I don't know why they chose the one that doesn't have its wings extended. Whatever, I guess. Uh, here we go. Is it because they were winging it? <laughs> <laughs> On city! Control. Right. Call me the Pontiff. Blue. Manny, give you ownership. Boom. Okay, you should be able to move it and stuff. All right. Cool. Is that your turn? Yep, that's my turn. Okay. Lucius. Uh, let me just do a quick measuring real quick. Yeah, I have just about enough movement. I will move right up to her face and I will save for wisdom, which I should be good at because I'm Wait. a paladin. Wait, uh, you, oh, for, sorry, for the person behind me, uh, behind this, uh, you were in my uh, range of um, 10 HP? Kentrel? Yes. Galvin. Or no, Kentrel okay. moved, moved out of it. Flying on the Pegasus. Um, no, okay, okay, never mind. Okay. Oh, can I go? Anything else needs to go? No, go, 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 go. As a bonus action, I will train Channel Divinity Vowed Venmini on her. Ooh. And I will strike thrice at her. Okay. All at advantage. That's a 24 to hit. 24? We'll just miss. Shit, you're kidding? It's 25. Yep. We yeah, determined this earlier. To... Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm hell. trying to find me because of the armor. Fucking hell, I will strike twice more. That still doesn't hit. That's exactly the same roll. Shit. And that's a 29! 29 will certainly hit. She'll take 16 points of slashing reduced to whatever the fuck she takes. Eight. And action, bonus action. Yep, that's what I got. Okay. 
your first two strikes, that shield is really hard to get past it, and she's really good at using it. Just a shower of sparks. But the last one, you just come around to the side of her head just as she just blocked your other attack and just give, like, a scratch across her cheek. Yep. That's all I got. I'll have that for a drop of blood. <laughs> cool. End of your turn. Are you in my range? Do you want to roll the uh, 10 HP? He flew away. I am so far away from you. Never mind. Yeah, you're over here. I am here. so far away from you. They're over here. <laughs> All right. Legendary action. I'm fucked. Well, from my understanding, they can't do over level three for their legendary, so you're fine. <laughs> okay. They are going to do. You know what? With can I still use my move? Oh, I, I used all my movement. Never mind. Yeah, you used all your movement. Yep. Yeah, I'm just gonna let your bolt, lightning bolt your face. Okay. Make a deck save. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't. Yeah. I can pass this. I, I think. I don't think I can pass this. Ah, uh, yeah, I don't. You wait. No, you have advantage because of haste, right? I do, and I do have advantage on magical effects from the spellguard shield. Yes. Let's see. Uh, nope. Uh, okay. I take half of that. Man, we really need a bless on this party. Okay. Uh, what's half of 25 myth? 12. Cool. I got it. Sorry, I'm trying to angle it, but she would also shoot it at Contrell. So Contrell also give me a dexterity saving throw. Okay. Hey. So yeah, it's not letting me move it. Okay. So you'll take 12, Lucius, and Contrell, you will take 25 points of lightning damage. And that'll be a legendary okay. action. I think from my understanding of how their legendary actions go, and this is just, uh, you know, from my observations, their, their, their uh, cast spell legendary takes two, and their, and their uh, flyby takes one. So yeah, we can expect that in the future. Me. Yeah, yeah. All right, Gallifrey, it is your turn. I cast the spell magic. Okay. What's the range? 120. Oh, nice. just in. Uh, that also reminds me, Lucius Wisdom save against the Spirit Guardians. I almost forgot. Oh, ab absolutely, absolutely. My bad. No, you're good. Uh, I'm also not going to make it. Uh, yep. Oh, oh, I do. You made it. Nice. I That'll be as a good roll too. Good thing you made it. So uh -huh. the uh -huh. uh, have to eleven five points of necrotic damage. All right. Cool. Five points is nice. Gallifrey, you do a dispel magic. All right. She's way out of counter spell. Yep. Except for when she burns a meta magic point to do distant. Mm -hmm. Fuck off! Answer, she right? has extended spell. <laughs> burn them points. Burn them all. I'm gonna burn them all. Whatever. She is going to use a meta magic point to distant a counter spell as a beam of anti magic comes firing from Gallifrey's hands. Took that move from me, you bitch. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Anything else, Gallifrey? Uh. Ah, yes. Okay. Um. I remember, everybody. This is a play test. This is not the final iteration. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I, 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 I'll do the I'll give you. Thing. Yeah, I'll give you my judgments after, since I don't know if they have a phase two. Uh, 
Uh, okay, I'll do a an attack action for my acid action to, I guess, do another fire bolt. Okay. Yeah. Damage. Damage is damage. Oh, did she roll cons? Oh, she can't. I didn't deal enough damage for her to beat concentration. Yeah. 24. Ooh. 20. What's the d4 from? Plus from my hero potion. Oh, that's right. Sorry. it's You guys have so many buffs, it's so hard to keep track of. Uh, 24 okay. will just miss. Throws her shield up at the right time and glances off. Um. Yep, sounds good. Okay, that's me. Okay, you got it. She is then going to do a cantrip. She, yeah, face is going to melt off again. And she's going to do Toll the Dead on you, Lucius. Sure. Oh, same damage on both sides. That's a really good D8 roll. Good lord. That's not, yeah, that's not bad. That's not bad damage. Wisdom uh, save, save, Lucius. I do not... Oh, Ooh, Jesus. That was almost a 17, too. So that'll be 10 points of necrotic damage as the scream yep. just sucks the life out of you. And that'll bring Thank us to God Zrash. For potions and vulnerability. <laughs> Zrash, let's see here. How... Okay. Let's... I'm gonna do the dash action. To... Yep, just get right in front of her. Completely and utterly pissed at this point. Okay. Oh, uh, you run the measurement tool, weren't you? Oh, I am indeed. My bad. <laughs> uh, hello there. All right. Wisdom save. Oh. I literally can't make it. Oh, you are within five you feet of it. me. You have plus five from me. You can make it. Oh, you. Oh, I can't yep. actually make it then. You have plus five next to the paladin. They did a paladin. It is awesome. And I still get advantage, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, Heroes Feast. Yep, I keep Heroes forgetting which one's live guys. Oh, 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 I still can't. I still can't make anything. Christ. Jesus okay. Christ. All right. That's a so, two, a three, a four, and a six from us. Yep, that'll be seven points of necrotic damage as her spirit obsidian blade slash into you. Yes. Seven. All right. Anything uh, else, Rash? Uh, I hit to use both uh, dash, so I'm pretty sure that's it. Okay. It, it takes my bonus. Yeah, I was just checking to see if you had a bonus action or anything. All right, oh. that'll bring us down to Dawn. Fuck me. Okay, I'm gonna use my full <laughs> movement to try and get a little closer. It's not much. Um, it's 30 feet of movement. Christ and Lord in heaven. Um, yeah, I can only move like all the way up here. Okay. As I move up, DM, you said before, like, I can make an inside check or something onto the crystals. Yeah, uh, Arcana check. Or. Arcana check. Yeah, Arcana check. If you roll a nat 20, they're all made of adamantium. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> You just gotta slam her into them a bunch. As I make the account check, I will yell, yell, uh, yell out. Anyone have any visuals of the crystals and what they're about? Just in case anyone has got any I have I no do. idea. <laughs> Thanks. Oh. Uh, 18? Uh, 18. With an 18, you get the sense that these crystals are like some kind of battery that are uh -huh. holding on to a great deal of energy uh not not necessarily for her but for the device the device slash platform itself 
No oh, shit. <laughs> Well, oh, I'm going to be like, hey, uh, the kids are so better for the, for the platform, FYI, if anyone wants to do anything about it, just FYI, I don't know if it's for her or not, but hey, um, and, um, oh, Jesus fucking Christ, let me think what I can do, um, what can I do, what can I do, shit, 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 um, Toilet is 60 feet, right? I'm how many feet away from her? Seventy five ish. Yeah. Yeah, it looks about eighty five. Yeah, eighty five only really. Fuck me. Okay, um Spell magic is hundred and twenty feet. Everyone's been trying to cast it. I'm gonna try. You're gonna try? Worst case mm -hmm. worst case scenario it takes out her second reaction and yeah. forces her to spend more four three points. True. Okay. Uh, she is indeed going to spend another meta magic point to counterspell that. Okay. Honestly, that's good. That's good. No, it's uh, good. It's my yeah. one for, uh, third level spell. Um, that was my action. Bonus action. It's, oh, shoot. I lost visual. Um, people within. Uh -oh. Did my internet poop? Nope. Nope. Okay. We got you. Um, anyone who is within, like, um, I'm going to try and see if I can. I, I'm looking at people within. What's the healing word thing? Sixty feet of me. People in the sixty feet of me. How are you feeling? <laughs> I think there's uh, only I one person. Been, there's like two people. Save me your spells. I have yeah. not been hit. Yeah. So. Save, save your stuff. But, Okay. Um, in that case, do you already use my? Yeah, you also used my misty step already, so I can't do shit. Um. Did you take fate touch? You... Did she already? Did she already? No, I I'm fate touched. Yeah. Um. Oh, that means you, you can, can use misty step. Yeah. Yeah, you can use it with your other slots. Oh. Yeah, well, as here's long, my question, as DM. As long as you um, know the spells, this, this, yes. Yes, but this 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 bitch. She's used her reaction and her legendaries, right? So she, she has nothing left. She used her two reactions. Yep. Just two reactions left? No, so she used both of them. She has no more reactions. Oh, yeah, she did use both of them, yeah. And her cool. turn is kind of coming up, so... Yeah, that's why I'm asking. Because I, I had trouble, like, trying to tally stuff. Yeah, she cast a spell, and then she mm -hmm. used another legendary action to uh, toll the dead on Lucius. Can I use, like, a stealth check to try and hide what I'm going to do? Yeah, yeah, I'm okay with that. What are you trying to do? That, that's kind of sick. Well, that's a 19 for stealth. I want okay. this to succeed. It's my one eighth level spell. I'm going to cast Holy Aura. <gasps> oh, boy. Yikes. Yo, that's a good one. Woo! Cleric! Okay. That is one of the best spells in the entire game. Cleric! But I wanted to know if I succeed in the... I, well, I don't know if I succeed in the stealth, I guess. But... Don't yeah. know if you succeed. Okay. But that's an action, right? So I can't do it, actually. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. Oh yeah, because you dispel magic. Level you also one. can't cast two leveled spells oh, in the same turn. That's also true. But oh, I yeah, will yeah, hide. Yeah, I will yeah. hide that from. I will hide that from the DM so he doesn't know. And I'm gonna prepare <laughs> it. I'm just gonna be like, <laughs> it's okay. okay I, don't I, worry about I, it. I got, yeah. You got it. I got you. Got you. It. Okay. You got it. All right, Don. Any bonus actions or anything, or is that the end of your turn? Otherwise, I can't. Otherwise, you. Otherwise, I go. <laughs> that's what I do, and I roll. Roll. My temp HP points, and that's what I do. Okay. You got it. All right. And... Neji! All right. Uh, I will do that perception check to uh, find the weakness in the armor. Okay. Give me a perception check. Uh, that is a Come 21. On. 21. 21. Giving her a once-over. You... 
There's a couple of things that you uh, realize. There is no weaknesses in this armor because it is made out of adamantium. Okay. She's fucking immune to crits. Second. Wait, but does that mean if we crush the um, adamantium on her, does that mean she's vulnerable to it? Yeah, that's what he said. I didn't what say else? anything like that. I said she was wearing adamantium armor. Uh, yeah, but the what else? second thing is she has a sentinel shield. Okay. Okay, so that adds uh, advantage perception checks, and Nikki won't do that. So, oh, okay, so. All right, here's what he's going to do. Uh, Nagy's gonna go up, and I have 110 movement, so, um, what I actually want to do is, I want to act like, um, like, as I'm going up, I'm going to, like, smack curve this adamantine staff, but what I want to do is, I want to, like, f like, slide under everybody, slide, like, like, slide under, and then try to, and from behind, I want to try to knock out her shield. Okay. Oh. Um, you're uh, not a, you're is not that a, a full battle. action to disarm the shield? It is a full action because you're not a battle master. Oh, I don't know if I want to do that then. Um, if you go five feet more up, you're flanking with me. So at uh, least that'll he doesn't do flanking. Also, can you? Oh, sure. oh, you have a broom of flying. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I was like, can you fly? <laughs> I, I definitely can. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I don't do flanking. There is uh, enough. There's enough that, ways. Um, there's enough ways in the game to do to give yourself advantage. Yeah. Uh, well. Yeah. I assume I can't faint then. Like with that, like try to like move behind and like try to like fake her out, then try to go behind and get advantage on one attack. I think it can. Like with acrobatics or something. Is that possible? Okay. Hmm. You're using uh, so you're using one attack to fake her out, and then your second attack to gain with for with advantage. No, no, I was just saying. Oh no, no, that's. I was saying like, try to fake her out, then go behind and get the advantage. Maybe with, like with acrobatics. I'm not gonna waste an attack uh, to, for just one advantage on another attack. Uh, if, if, if no, that's fine. I'm gonna say no. Maybe if you were like a rogue or something, I would go for I it. I am part but... rogue. Do you have cunning action? Do you have a bonus action I don't, to like anyway. stealth? Okay. Nope. <laughs> okay. All right. Oh, I didn't mean to roll that. Okay, so I'm going to hit with the adamantine quarter stuff. Okay. Uh, that plus the hit is not right. That should be an extra one, plus a d4. So twenty-two. Uh, that is a uh, exactly. twenty-five. Like, twenty-five to exactly. hit. Exactly. Twenty-five hits. And she okay, that will... should be nine. That should be nine damage. It, sh it should be another plus one. It's weirdly okay. not though. Okay, you got it. I trust you. Um, okay, so nine points will double to eighteen points of damage. Okay, and uh, this is just for testing. I am going to sudden strike that. Okay, so. Neji, as you swing this adamantine quarterstaff and as it connects, uh, we'll say with like <laughs> the side of her head, <laughs> you feel this. Yeah, I'm just going to say you feel this like blessing through it, this divine energy run through the adamantine weapon as it connects into the side of her head, dealing that extra. Yeah, that double the damage 19 or yeah, yeah, 19 points of damage or 16. Fuck it, sixteen. Okay, yeah. Yep. Plus, plus three back. That's no, it's eight, no, it's eighteen. No, yeah, it's eighteen. Because it's nine damage. Oh, that's oh, right. Oh, you're right. God damn oh, yeah, it. that's right. Yeah. Oh, you, you, made it, yeah you made the you made the quarter stop correlate with my strength. So it's it's. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's, I'll fix I'll fix oh, that right now. Yeah. Jesus, I forgot to fix it. You did say that too. Yeah, you like a monk weapon? No, you're good. Okay. Uh, no, you're good. Stunning strike. Let me double check. She is immune to stunt. Yep. Okay. That's good. That's good information to know. I will hit again. Okay. Oh. And uh, bless. With the D4. Uh, that's a 25. 25. So 28 damage. All right. 28 Woo! points of damage. Once again, that staff, as soon as it connects with the side of her head, there's some kind of 
divine rush that you feel as you smack her. <laughs> it's like I found your weakness. <laughs> That's bad for you. Good. Let's have a fair fight then. Come on, let's go. <laughs> and I will use my bonus action to a uh, uh, patient defense. Okay. Uh, spending one key point to take the dodge action as a bonus action. Okay, you got it. Anything else? Uh, and... So I haven't really played a monk before, so I'm just taking my features and all that, if you would give me, um... One second. <laughs> yeah, that'll be my turn. Okay. You got it. Come on, let's... Oh, wait, no. What, actually, 1d6 from sneak attack. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, well, I'm okay with that. Damage, please, which so another, damage. another two points of damage. You got it. Yes. Damage is damage. <laughs> cool. All that points down. She is going to immediately turn to you, Neji, right. and she is going to cast a spell magic. That that any is chance she's gonna drop? Con is she gonna drop concentration because of all those cool hits? Probably not. That's a good well, maybe point. Maybe the 28. Yeah, maybe the 20. No, yeah, the 28, maybe. 28. That's a DC 14. Uh, constitution. She cannot fail. Ooh. Jesus. Okay, that, that's expected. Okay. So she's going to roll a charisma check because it's a uh, what's globe of invulnerability? Uh, six level. Six level. DC 16. Oh! Fucking A. She fails again. Oh! Wasting her action. Oh! Yikes. Yikes. Oh! <laughs> I hate that. James, I hate that your bullshit keeps succeeding and it's the only one thing the keeping us alive. Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, she can't cast another spell as a bonus action. Just checking. You yeah, see, if you yeah, guys I'm... think if you guys think there's a lot going on with your sheets, there's just as much going on with mine. <laughs> yeah. you, you just see like as like the the thing goes off, like as her hand goes off, you see Negi just like use his key and like make a key ball and like just blast their hand away. Nice. All right, sweet. That pisses her off. She's surrounded by three people. Not a huge fan of taking that many attacks of opportunity, so she'll stay put for now, bringing us to Kentrol. All right, let's surround her by four people. I want to fly up. Whoa, 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 whoa. There you go. There you go. Oh, also, please remember that all of your saves at plus 10 right now, Neji and Barbarian. All right. Me plus five? No, oh, two or paladins. Or is the back? The paladin auras of protection do not stack, unfortunately. Oh. Oh, that sucks. Uh, well, hey, I don't know about that. <laughs> I think it's that pretty was reasonable. Well. I think that's that pretty Manny reasonable. Entire, that was Manny and I's entire pitch for this thing. I mean, an entire party, a, par a party of six paladins would have, with 20 charisma, would have six times five, a plus 30. No. <laughs> I see no problem with it. This is a, this is a, demo <laughs> this is a democratic universe. <laughs> I see no problem with this. That's hilarious. All right, Kentrell, what would you like to do? All right, attack with the longsword. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. We need damage. We need damage on the board at this point. Uh, yeah. Oh, that's right. You're rolling in 24. It just misses, unfortunately. That's. that's... Oh, sure. So I get two attacks per action right now. So let me try Correct. Again. You mm -hmm. get two attacks. 31. <laughs> Is that a crit? It was not. It was an 18. Oh, it was an 18. Goddamn. 31 certainly hits. Uh, 11 damage. 11 damage that will unfortunately be halved to five. Okay. Greatly blessed by divine energy. I think that's all I'm going to do. So, yeah. Okay. End of your turn. Yeah, she's just going to dispel magic on Neji again. 
Oh, and he just left. Oh, did he? Oh, okay. Yeah. He said so BRB. Yeah. Right. Okay, well, he's he's going to find out when he gets back, I guess. Insight, not enough Gallifrey. I'm sorry. She's going to... I mean, I can try and warn him, right? Yeah, a lot. Uh, not enough. Not enough, unfortunately. All right, charisma check. DC 16. That will succeed. Uh, but silvery barbs? Okay. <laughs> 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 yeah. ah, she had to roll yeah, good at some point. Better. Awesome, yeah. okay, that's fine. That's completely fine by me. All right, your globe of invulnerability. Down, like, kind of lowers. <laughs> but I can do it, right? I will throw the advantage to control. Well, no, throw it to me. Throw it to me. I have the okay, Adamantine. Okay, James. Yeah, if you're okay, within range, Gallifrey, you can silvery... I, can you stack silvery barbs? I think I don't you know, can. Actually. I don't see anything that says he can. Yeah, I guess he can. So, therefore, you must. <laughs> Hi. All right. She rolls again. <laughs> What's the range? Okay. 60 feet? 60. Yeah, she is, right on. She, she is 65 feet in the air, though. Oh, okay. Oh. I thought you weren't going to do Pythagoras. It's 65. No, she though. is mathematically. She is mathematically 65 up, so that's five <laughs> yeah. on range. Okay, okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so that's her legendary action. Globe of Invulnerability <laughs> dissipates off of Neji. That'll bring us to mm -hmm. Lucius's really turn. Uh, just to make it pretty, I'm gonna move up here. Oh! Wisdom saves! Good lord, except for Neji, I suppose. Kentrell, oh, yeah. oh, cool. Lucius, wisdom saves. With advantage to all of you! Yep. With advantage, yeah, plus including... Plus five. Plus five. Oh, fucking... <laughs> including the oh, Pegasus. I can... Wait. That's a pass. There's Rash. Yeah, yeah, yeah you passed. Five. I actually That's passed. Woo! I passed. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> I passed. I passed. saving throw. <laughs> Holy shit! Holy fuck! All right. I was just realizing how good monks are. Holy uh, shit! That's a shitty ass roll too. So Zrash, you'll take oh. two points of necrotic. Uh, Ooh, anybody else? Take yep. The rest of you I take, take five. Five if you have invulnerability. Ten if you don't. Neji takes nothing because your global uh, invulnerability one, still would have been up. 121 minus 5. It's funny because I also have resistance to necrotic. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> um, okay. So, as an object interaction, I'm going to pass my second potion of invulnerability to, uh, to Manny. You bastard. <laughs> Uh, because he needs it more than I do, or I will. And we know that she has adamantine armor, right? I don't Which think means Neji I has cannot said crit yet. on her. <laughs> Neji has not said that. <laughs> Neji has not said yet. Okay, so, okay, so I'm gonna Hexblitz curse her. Okay. As my bonus action. I mean, you gain additional damage when you hit with it, so I would I don't see why not. Yeah. The problem is I now crit on 19. <laughs> Hell yeah. Which means I still don't hit. Yeah, and that's a crit. So Ooh. So Woo! nothing happens. It would have been. <laughs> so uh, That's good. I mean that's so still good. That's still good. Yeah, Lucius with no, ease. No, it deals her no damage. Uh Lucius she with ease. Crit. Yeah, she's immune uh, crit. crit. Adamantium armor. Uh you whip that sword right around, slash across um the side of her face, giving a nice good gash. Uh, for it looks like, ugh, half of nineteen. No, she takes the fourteen. She takes the fourteen, by the way, because it's a crit. Ooh. Oh no, it's specifically on the, uh, or is it specifically on the twenty? It might be specifically on the twenty. Specifically on the twenty, so it's not about yeah. crits. Yeah, it's about the twenty. Yep. Oh, uh, okay. That's unfortunate. All right, so nine points of damage to her, which to you, Lucia, seems odd because that was a hell of a hit. But she seems to, she like lifts one of the pauldrons of her armor and it just like glances off slightly. And that's, that's weird. Immune to crits. Second hit. Okay. 
Uh, that doesn't. That should have done more. Shitty roll. That should, uh, actually, no, it's not my turn. I'm not gonna say that. No, it shouldn't have done done more, James. I I literally don't do more damage than that. No, I mean, uh, Nagi was gonna, Nagi was gonna say, well, it's, it's like the same material as my quarter staff. The long sword of sharpness. I will. No, the uh, my st staff and like their armor. Oh, yeah. Uh, I will say that on my turn, however. No, nope, no, nope, that's not it. That's not it. That's the wrong no thing. Uh, yeah, twenty-seven. Twenty-seven certainly hits. That's good damage. Eleven points of damage. Yeah, that's max. All right. And I use action, bonus action. I literally have nothing else I can do. Yep, that's all that Lucius is going to do. Okay. She is then going to use a legendary action. Yeah. Should do Fleet of Flight. Can we attack of opportunity? <laughs> that's a lie. <laughs> Absolutely. You can all take attacks of opportunity. Hi. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna do that. Yep, she I'll... stays right here. Oh! What? She Ooh, stays right here. Beautiful! We still don't get our attacks! She turns, her, she turns her back on me and I, like, basically slash the back of her, of her knees, like, no, 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 not yet. <laughs> that's a four, that's 14 damage for me. Okay, you got it. The yeah, so, monks are not too bad. 17, that is going to be 8 points more of damage. 7, which is going to be mean high level 14 monks. points of damage. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why it's the slashing. Should be oh, because I had to use an adamantine longsword because for some reason I couldn't find quarter staff. So, bleh, ignore the slashing. It's bludgeoning. Doesn't really matter. Uh, 22 will not hit, but she's going to use the second half of her fleet of flight. And she's going to take an attack with advantage against Lucius Von Rex. Mm -hmm. Oof. Oh, this is going to hurt. Oh, that's really cool, actually. And since it's a wave of energy, she's definitely. Oh, I guess she could only get like she only can face one direction. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. So she'll aim it towards Neji and Lucius. Lucius, or Neji, is not with it. Ooh, okay. Interesting. Oh, God. Okay, wow. things are about to get interesting. So, Neji, okay. 36 to hit. Uh, uh, it's, not, it's not with advantage against you, it's just with advantage against Lucius. Okay. Okay, so you're, so Neji, you're going to take 13 plus 8 plus 8. So 16 plus 13. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm resistant to uh, Radiant and Necrotic, so... Got it. Do your own math. Yep, um, I am. Lucius. This does not do the extra damage, but I need you mm -hmm. to make a constitution saving throw. I'm halfway decent at those. I should make those. They just blew up my they just blew up my temp HP. I'm still on hard. <laughs> I, I do have advantage on this. Oh. oh and I just off. missed it. Okay. Uh, here's what happens. Uh... Lucius, as she, as you slash across her back, getting like past some gap in her armor, she spins around blindingly fast, almost like there's another copy of her inside of herself. There's like this translucent essence to her that like strikes out at you. And this wave of gold and black shadow <laughs> bursts through you. And as it dissipates, all of you see these spikes of obsidian have pierced through Lucius's body and you are paralyzed. Oh, oh shit. Oh, oh, yeah. oh. I can rid myself of that, I think. I think I might be very, very... Oh, before she hits me, can I do Soul of Vengeance? I don't know what that is. <laughs> what is that? Uh, if a when a creature under the effect of Vow of Enmity makes an attack, I can use my reaction to make a melee weapon attack, if it is within range. You already used your reaction to a sentinel attack. Oh, you are correct. Okay. So how much hurt did I just take? Um, 
Well, the 13, the 8, and 8. No additional damage. Just the paralyze. Thir- on, a, on a natural 20 for her. So 13 plus... Oh, 13 plus 8 plus 8 is 29 divided by 2. I take 14 points. 14 points of damage. Got it. Okay. Um... Here's the funny thing. She has mobile, and she made an attack. She has zero movement also. Because that That's reduces true. their movement by zero, so... That's true. That's Choose true. zero. She did. Yep, nope, you're right. You're 100% right. You got it. All right, she can't move anywhere anyway. Cool. That is her last... That is her legendary action, bringing us to Gallifrey. Right. Is there a reason why I would have advantage on attacks? I don't think so. Okay, then. Uh, I'll yell to Dawn and I'll be, I'll, I'll say, pay attention. And then uh, I will move back. And good. Okay. I'll use my haste action to use an object interaction with my ever smoking bottle. Mm. So now there's a 60 foot radius heavy obscurement. Good God. Location. Pew. And then I'm going to cast a spell magic. Oh, that's smart as hell. That's smart as hell. Oh my god. Fuck. That's some big ass brain play. Yeah, because they have to see the counter spell. Oh. Wow. (laughs) Fuck, man. (laughs) All right. Uh, I just got you there. Fourth level because I'm running on a third level. Okay. Womp womp. Fun fact too, I do not believe that true sight allows you to see through heavy obscurement. It doesn't. doesn't. I know this very well. It I does not. This. Oh so, my god. That is beautiful. Third level beats, third level spirit guardians will dissipate and vanish. Hey. Uh, very all good. Right, so then I'm going to leave the bottle there. You got uh, it. And I'll get closer. Maybe. There's such a pile of fuck going on. Here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, everybody's just. <laughs> it's like that JoJo's Bizarre meme where everybody's just around that one figure just kicking you know. the shit of them on the ground. <laughs> it's the uh, Spider Man pointing meme. We're all in a circle pointing at each other. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I guess I'm just going to go like here. Okay. And then, uh, so I have a bonus action left. Um, nope, can't reach. Okay. That's me. Okay. You got it. Um, yeah, that's all of our legendary actions. That'll bring us to Zrash. Uh, Zrash, may I make a suggestion, if you don't mind? Uh, I am perfectly fine with that. I... Since you're raging, I think this is a good time to try to get that shield out of her hands. Because mm. right now, I think that the AC is too high for us to do damage consistently. So, and and you could probably like, since you're raging, I think it's a good time to, to get the shield out. You have no more reactions, no more that. So, you know that is perfectly fair. I wouldn't have thought of that. Uh, yeah, okay. I guess it's, it's, I. Yeah, so it's an adamantine. I think the shield's giving the brunt of the AC, is my theory. Hmm. Alright. Then, yeah, okay. Let's start with that, then. I'm going to attempt to pry the shield from this woman's hands. Alright, that will be a contested grapple check. You make your athletics check with advantage, and she will make her own athletics check. Okay. That was so close. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. 27. I mean, he does have a second. He does have a second attack, or is it one per turn? Uh, No, 
Ex it's extra you can attacks. Isn't yeah, you can. I'm considering it a grapple, so you can attempt yeah. two times to rip it free if you'd like. All right, let's do it again. All right, come on, <laughs> let's do it. Second verse. Same do it again. Verse. I think we get the shield out. It's we have a better chance of winning. Oh, no, wow! No, 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 no. <laughs> wow! I get shit. Seventeen. I mean, she might roll trash. Apparently, she, she did. did. Oh, meets oh, it. No, no, no. Oh. Meets it. Beats it. Beats it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right, I am literally just flinging that fucker as hard as I can <laughs> next All turn, right, I guess. you rip it. No, you can do it as an object interaction. You rip oh, okay. it from her arm and you throw it. You're strong enough. You throw I... it over the edge of this platform. Yeah, it's speeding off like a fucking bullet with 25 strength. Okay. That's called that's called big brain place. Yep. <laughs> big brain place. <laughs> All right, Zrash, is that any, everything you would like to do with your turn? Uh, yeah, I think so. It's a good turn. Good, good on you, Zrash. That was good. That's that was a good. healthy turn. That's a healthy turn. It did healthy stuff to us. Honestly, Pandora didn't really stuff. do shit this shit this round. They were focused on dispelling me. Yep. <laughs> She's about yeah, to ruin we'll... me if, if no one heals me, so... No, 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 I have not No, I have a plan for you, don't worry. Question. Attunement. How far away before the attunement is broken that an item gets? Um, I mean, if it is for the... I mean, if, if it is for the sake purpose of AC. Yeah. No, not for the purpose of AC. As soon as the shield's ripped off her arm, the AC goes, but I was saying for the benefits oh, okay. of a sentinel shield. Uh, all right. Mm. That I does... have to look that up. Uh, it's 100 feet, so in D&D, things just immediately plummet. So she no longer has the benefits of a sentinel shield. It's good. It's good. Get her sword next! <laughs> I just, not as, just gonna... Honestly, not as important, because there's no rogues in the, in the party right now, but eh, it's there. <laughs> All right. <laughs> That'll bring us to Dawn. Your turn. Okay. Um, I just want to make sure, um, that what, Kendra, uh, how much are you out of your full hit points? I am at 94 out of 174. 174. Okay, cool. Got cool, some wear cool. and tear. Fun, fun, fun. Got some wear and tear um, on him. I am going to oh, fly up. Um, uh, oh, where am I? Here I am. She is here. Here comes the girl. Um, I'm <laughs> going to move my full 30 feet up in this um, miasma. And okay. hold on. Wait, why can't I? You were ruling, I'm pretty sure. You can do this. Yeah, here we go. That puts me within 60 feet of control, right? Uh, 60 feet? Yes. No. Yes, it does. Well, 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 what do we have here? I'm gonna do a seventh level heal on him. Ooh! Yeah. All right. So. Eighty Kentrell, points of healing. Uh, you heal. For, isn't it seventy? Thought it was seventy. Eighty. Well, because they're upcasting it. They're upcasting. Yeah. Because oh, it was. It. I I don't have any. I don't have any six level spell slots left. So I took my seventh level on him. Okay, you got it. It's good. I understand That's now. Good. Puts me back at full health. Yeah. Hell yeah, brother. Uh -huh. You just see like a wink from an owl as you <laughs> into like the the thing. Um, I can't do much else, yeah, but I okay. would love to Healing insight major. check the um. I would love to insight check the crystals a little bit more if possible. Uh, okay. Yeah, you did. You did an arcana already. I'll say, yeah. Give me an insight check. I'm okay with an insight. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 27. Ooh, goddamn. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> Jesus. High level D&D. Insight check. Uh, as you, Dawn, take a moment to look at the runes kind of sur uh, surrounding a lot of these rings kind of below the platforms, and then the runes surrounding the crystals, you realize with a sinking feeling in your heart that this is 
Not a contraption. But it's a weapon. Hey, bitches, the crystals are a weapon. Just FYI, this is not good. Like, very bad news. Beep. Ooh, you just hear like, this voice from the cloud. That's all you do. Don, it is a weapon meant to siphon energy from the gods themselves to cast it's a them weapon. down from their thrones. It's a weapon oh, yeah. to like, you to throw the gods. <laughs> All right, is that your turn? Yeah, I just yelled at Phil the Cloud. Okay. Be woo! <laughs> okay, uh, that's the end of your turn? Yeah, I can't do anything else right now. I'm just like flapping. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. All right, next pa Pandora, I'm, your god of death requires you to show your strength, but I think you've already showed it. You want to cast down the gods, but is it really worth throwing the balance out? We can all be friends. We can, we can make balance not by not by destroying everything, but by just living. You don't have to do this. Mother loves me. I do what mother says. I get that. Well, are you gonna so are you gonna let them dictate Fuck your life? Fuck your mother. <laughs> <laughs> Are you going to let them dictate your life? It, do you truly think this is the right way to go? They're throwing all the gods, throwing the world order out of balance? Mother will be the balance that you need, heretic. But there needs to be life. Fuck your mother. Not gonna lie, what my woman said. <laughs> there needs to be life. There still will so, be under mother death. And I'll show you what it means. And uh, I will attempt a grapple check. Okay. Um, can you use acrobatics for it? No. <laughs> okay. Uh, I have advantage from silver oh. bars and everything. So. Okay. Can he? A grapple check. Yeah. Okay. I do have proficiency. <gasps> Ooh, and uh, bless. Cool. And bless. That would be a thirty. She hasn't used any reactions. She's going to use her action to Silvery Barbs you. Oh. Uh, so 13 plus, that's a 20, 25 in total. Oh, you roll it. Yeah, I'm not going to roll that for you. That's crazy. I mean, it, I... it already rolled over there, so you... I was like, oh, okay. Oh, you just want to use that one? Okay. Yeah, 22. That one. You got it. Uh, That's a... No, that's I have a plus ten, so that's a uh, twenty-three plus two from yeah twenty-three plus two from bless is uh, twenty-five. Okay, twenty-five. You got it. Twenty-three. Yep. Yes. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. Half my movement, fifty-five feet. Uh, bonus action. Uh, I'm going to step in the wind. So one hundred twenty feet. I'm going to move up with her one hundred twenty feet. Then suplex her all the way down. <laughs> she is a flying creature. You cannot suplex her. <laughs> no, with that attitude. I can't suplex. You oh, cannot he has... suplex a flying creature. <laughs> James. James, Unle James, James. Unless you knock her prone or you stun her, you cannot suplex her. Oh, <laughs> <she's>... oh. <laughs> And she's kind of immune to stun as well. <laughs> okay, I'm going to move. I'm going to uh, move down. Uh, I'm gonna still step at the window. It's bonus action. I'm okay. going to move down. Uh, actually, yeah, I'm gonna. Uh, I'm, no, I'm not actually. I'm going to move down 55 feet with her. Okay. So we're both 10 feet off the ground. Okay. And and I believe their thing is 30 feet, so they're out of range of our boy up here, who is paralyzed. That was my main plan. Uh, I can't, I can't like slam her down or anything. Uh, Myth. Try to get fall her damage. Becomes, her no, speed she's becomes a flying zero creature. Regard okay. she be her speed becomes zero regardless because of grapple. Is that not going to have it any is. effect? It does become zero. That's why I'm. That's what I'm saying. Like, that's why I wanted to go down so they don't hit the paralyzed guy up there. 
Right, but she can still use her wings to prevent a full force slam into the ground. Like, your wings okay, are not bound or that's anything. Fair. That's fair. Okay, yeah, that's fair. Okay, um, so that was one attack, and I will use my second one to, uh, to Adamantine Quarterstaff. Okay. And that will not hit even with bless. And not hit. Um, even without the shield, she has full plate. She is heavily armored. Oh wait, let me have the bless. Uh, actually, they don't have the shield anymore. So okay, nineteen Nin will probably not hit. Nineteen does not hit. Yep, that's what I expected. And uh, what I am going to do is she can also <laughs> heal again. You're in place now! And then, right, right at, like, as he's grabbing her, he uh, gets a key blast in his hand and will just blast toward it towards her. Uh, Alka, I'm using my bonus action to use... Uh, to use Searing Arc Strike. Immediately after I take the attack action, I may use a Burning Hands. And I am using uh, five key points. It's going to be at level five. Okay. Yikes. You got it. As a massive key blast just comes in. Let's go! Do not go burst! <laughs> <laughs> What's the DC? Uh, yeah, that'll uh, that'll pass. <laughs> it's 18. Okay. Uh, roll damage. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna roll it manually since it's it's not doing it. For yeah, me. go for it. Uh, wait, no, can I do that? Yeah, there's T sixes at the bottom, bottom right. That's weird. It, it's it's not like letting me upcast it. So that's another. So it's a level one spell. So plus six more. Okay. Do not go burst. Well, bam. That's a total of twenty nine. Twenty nine points of damage. So that uh, succeeds, which halves it to fourteen. And because of her uh, tiefling ancestry, that knocks it down to seven. What? It barely did anything. <laughs> She She's not even in her final form. <laughs> yeah, she smiles as you blow dry her hair. <laughs> she looks fabulous. More fabulous than when, before you cast it. <laughs> what? All right. I'll stop you, okay? I won't kill you, though. <laughs> we will. You can uh, suck that'll be my turn. Plan. Wasn't okay. your plan to help me? Yeah, yeah, she cannot reach you from up there. Oh, yeah, that's true. That's why I grappled her. They have to they have to use their action to break out my grapple check. That's what That is smart as fuck. Yeah, exactly. Okay. That's exactly why I grappled. I'm sorry I doubted you, James. <laughs> Wouldn't let me suplex, remember, remember. <laughs> I thought okay. it was a really cool idea in my head. Yeah. She is going to Close her eyes for a moment. She's going to focus. Oh no! Sick of foods. And Wait, then, yeah, can you can you scroll down a bit so I can see where I am? Yes, you are right Thank there. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, she is going to close her eyes and focus. And then, shimmering, seemingly out of nowhere. This is not a spell. Are going to be four. Obsidian sides wreathing with black and gold flame. And I will add them to the initiative. Oh, second phase! Yikes. They have a group initiative, so I'll just roll for one of them. <laughs> Not this fight's so cool, man. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, and then she is going to use a meta magic point. To quicken cast. Holy Aura. That's kind of spell, boys. Kind of spell, boys. 
Let's get. That's a counter spell and a half if I ever seen one. Yeah. Not enough. I will. I can roll. I'm paralyzed, but that doesn't mean I can't roll. You are incapacitated. I'll take actions. Oh, I can give fuck. it. There it is. Twenty six. Yep. Can troll? Can you counter spell? Yep. You can. Yep. Okay. I'm gonna have to roll. What do I need to roll? There's something about the crowd here. Will you marry me? Uh, you need to roll a charisma check. Just pure charisma check. DC 18. You got Yikes. this, bro. You got this. Ah, oh, you tried. It's, it's all enough. good. It's all good. You tried. You... Yeah. You're also... Yeah. Oh no, she's, yeah, okay, she's 10 feet off the ground still. Okay, so you focus and you send that force of anti-magic, but there it's just too powerful a spell and it just breaks apart as it impacts. And as she we opens her eyes, <laughs> as she opens her eyes and her eyes just brighten and flare as along with her whole golden body with this blinding aura of pure divine energy. What did you do? Bring about your end. My end will not come. Not when Tom is with me. <laughs> That's Holy Aura or... Holy Aura, yes. Holy Aura, yeah. We have disadvantage on all attacks against them. We need to get that down now. It's disadvantage all attacks, so basically the shield going away doesn't mean anything right now. And the fucking scythes. The scythes is the least of our worries, and we can't even hit them. Oh, <laughs> shit! Turn that down just slightly. Yeah, please. Fireball. That is her full turn. Um, yep, signs and everything, bringing us to Kentrel. It is your turn. It is just okay. hard to look at her. There is, she is just literally a silhouette of bright, pure energy in the center of all of this light. Um, may I make a suggestion? Yeah. Probably go for the scythes. It's, it's gonna be very unlikely you even hit her. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I want to fly over to the scythes. Okay, you got it. So that'll put you oh. to... Oh, you already moved yourself. You got it. All right. So do they each have their own individual health? Or... Uh, you'll have to find out. Okay. Well, I'm, I'm going to attempt to attack this one. Okay. They do not count as creatures, so they do not benefit from her holy aura. Okay, okay. Good. Okay, that was the right call then. <laughs> 24. 24 hits. Right, 22 damage. Okay. They are resistant as you strike out at them for 22, for 11 points of slashing damage. Practically, you can smite these, right? Can certainly yeah. try. Okay. Yeah. Let's get the knowledge straight first. See what we can do. So I'll use my second attack. Knowledge in these fights are like the most important thing. <gasps> oh! 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 Maybe he's trying to smite that. <laughs> All right. I mean, it's the only crit smite we're gonna get tonight. So. All right. Let's go. It's a damage. From the sword. <laughs> crit smite! Crit smite! What kind of damage should I do? Probably just a second level, right? Yeah. We, we don't we don't, don't know if they're like immune or anything, so probably not gonna waste too much resources. Yeah, throw 68 out there. <laughs> Let's go! 
That's delightful. I, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna go with the blinding smite. Oh, as a bonus action? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So you can either roll. Okay. You can either roll another three d eight, or you can double the seventeen. Up to you. I'll double the seventeen. Double seventeen. You got it. Uh, and they have to make a con save. Well, they don't have to make the con save um, because they cannot they be blinded. They are a weapon. Oh. They are. Yeah, they are not a creature. Um, so seventeen doubled though. That's fifteen plus. Or that's thirty plus four is thirty-four points of damage. Very good. Badly injured. And the rate and the radiant all went through. All of it went through. Oh. Right, yeah. Yeah, you see that this like ethereal like scythe begins to like diminish and like turn ethereal, having a hard time holding on to a more you know solid manifestation. All right, I think we found where the paladins belong in this fight. Um, yep. All, I have. <laughs> <laughs> all right, is that your turn? Yep. Okay. End of your turn. Um. Yeah, the scythe is going to swing back at you as a legendary action. <laughs> 27, oh, <laughs> which will deal. Oh, God. Oh, damn. <laughs> you already, you're, but you're at full health, right? Yeah. Okay. Is our fatality oh, still you up? Your... Have you been making con saves for that? They use blinding spine, so it's technically not a. Oh, yeah. Okay. I mean, he, yeah, I yeah, think okay. this would be it. Yeah. OK, we'll just say because, yeah, because I've forgotten stuff like that. And it's a one shot. Uh, OK, cool. Sweet. So you will take, yeah, 20 points of necrotic and six points of radiant. Who is that direct toward me? Yeah, you, Kentrell. OK, um, I, I do have um, it says I have resistance to uh, necrotic. Okay, then 10 points of necrotic. Yeah. All right, Ooh. end of the legendary action. That'll bring us to Lucius, who is paralyzed. At the Wonderful. start of your turn, you can make a um, yeah, constitution saving throw. Oh, start? That's generous. Um, uh, um, yeah, I'm, not a, I'm, not a, I'm, not a, I'm not a monster. <laughs> yeah, I'm, uh, I like yeah, the story. 24, that just passes. 20. Right. Why do you have advantage? Uh, I have spell guard. And hero's it's feast. It is not a spell. And hero's feast. Hero's feast is wisdom no, but saves. It's, no, it's spells and other oh. magical effects. It is not a magical effect. It is a weapon effect. Well, but hero's feast. Hero's Wait, feast no, is wisdom saves. Oh, oh shit. Then, then, it's, then it's a 14, I guess. Then it's a 14. Lucius remains paralyzed. Which will bring us God, to the sides. A, I'm so glad mm -hmm. I fucking grappled her and brought her down. You would get, you would have gotten fucked. Oh yeah. Okay. Let's these see. Sides are gonna, these sides are the uh the damage dealers. Oh, I'm about to get slinged by one, I'm sure. They have to have 55 feet of movement, though. I don't think they, they do. They have 60 feet of movement. Well, are they smart enough to... Oh, wait, no, Pandora is. They probably control them. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, let's... Telepathically. I need lesser restoration. I have lesser <laughs> restoration prepared. <laughs> uh, Neji, have you used your reaction yet? I have not. Okay, you can take an attack of opportunity against this scythe here. Um, if you I'm would not like. gonna do that. I'm You're not gonna do that. One. Okay, no, no, then it is going to fly up fifty feet, and with its ten foot reach, um, oh sorry, f yeah, fifty five feet, and with its ten foot reach, is going to take a strike at Lucius with advantage. Yeah, sorry, oh, man, no. there's nothing I could do there. No, it'll fly sixty feet up. 
yeah, I'm trying to remember all the rules going into this. All right, yeah. so with advantage. Cleric, we might have a body on our hands. All right. <laughs> yeah, that's a, yeah, that's a crit. That immediately does double the damage. Um, so that'll well, be. It, it just deals normal damage because I'm still under potion of invulnerability. Correct. So 15 points of necrotic and seven points of radiant. Ouchie, wouchie. I am not doing so hot. Oh, oh makes two attacks. <laughs> Have to read my shit. Oh man, yeah, I know we get, need to get these sives away. Okay, second attack, 27 for Yeah, sure points thing, pal. And three points of radiant. I'm down to 61. All right, this scythe will attack Kentrel twice. Oh, not with advantage. Sorry, I didn't mean to roll that Kentrel. So now that one. one. That'll immediately 91. miss. Could have had that roll for me. Uh, 16 will also miss. <laughs> um, the other two are going to turn against Neji. Okay. 31. That'll hit. Uh, I am resistant to necrotic, so that'll be uh, uh, ten dam nine damage. Aren't you also, also aren't you also resistant to radiant? I am, yeah. Okay. Do your own math. Second attack, not one misses. Next. Thanks, Myth. Last scythe. Seventeen, I believe, misses you, Neji. Twenty-five AC. I figured. Uh, twenty-five meets it, beats it. Um, I will. You see, Neji. Well, Brandon, it's just quarterstaff. I'm going to defensive duelist, parry. Very good. Okay. Uh, which and... adds five to my AC for that one attack. Okay, you got it. Um, Pandora is going to use a legendary action after her sides to, yeah, make a scythe attack. Lucius again. Is she within reach of me? With the scythe, she commands them as a legendary oh, sure. action. Yeah, no, that hits. You okay. only seem to roll above a 10 for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know. It's also with advantage, so keep that in mind. So 16 and 9. Yeah, 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 no, the, it's rough. All right, Gallifrey, yeah, no, you're, you're... it's your turn. Yes. Gallifrey will Just... sigh and Dispel, yeah. move back into the cloud. <laughs> and cast well to spell magic. Oh! You, do you want to move in? With, do you want to end your turn in my uh, area? Probably not. Can you? I could. Good, but I don't have a reason to. I don't think. You don't have. Right. You don't want ten HP. I already have ten HP. Okay. I mean, oh, he okay. he's taken zero damage this whole fight. <laughs> well, well, because he keeps oh, running around. I was gonna say yeah. people surrounding Fuck her and shit. beating the shit out of her. All right, eighth level, holy aura is gone. That's that okay. That's big. That's super big. Okay, now I would like to run. Uh, how high can I jump? I have no idea at this point. <laughs> very, very. <laughs> Let's say rules? very. What are the rules for jumping? I, I don't know them. It's three times your strength modifier. I want to say no. That's but you're not... also hasted, so it's like, I don't know, as high as you could move, I guess. <laughs> Can I jump five feet to get within reach of her? Yes, oh, sure. absolutely. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> okay, so I will do... High jump, it's a number of feet equal to three plus your strength modifier. Okay, so then I can only jump three feet according to that rule. Because my strength modifier is zero. But you're, but you're GM hasted, might so allow I would, athletics. Oh, I yeah, would say sure. doubled because you're hasted, because of speed. Okay. Yeah. Uh, anyhow, so I jump up. Uh, I'll do my attack action. I'll make that a cantrip of um, green flame blade, I guess. Okay. Uh, looks like those one of those sites are close by. Uh, so... I think she's she's ten feet up, and this scythe is on the ground, and you can move through the scythes. By the way, they are ethereal. 
I can? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you can well, move through the sides. I'll do a booming blade if they're not in range. They're like souped up spiritual weapons. Okay. Um. So. I deck. Okay. Twenty-five hits. And so it does that, and then the booming blade damage. Okay, so four. Uh, four again, because fire. And then... We don't... We don't know how much AC they have now. I'm guessing they have, like, at least 22. That's my guess. 22, 21. No. Yeah? Is... Yeah. Joe, is the three... What's the three? Is that... Oh, is that Bless? The Bless. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, 28 certainly hits. Absolutely. Two die eight at this level. Green flame blade. There's gonna be oh thunder. Oh booming blade. All right, three more points. Oh no, seven more points of damage. Sorry, they're not resistant to thunder, or she is not resistant to thunder. Okay, and she begins shimmering with thunderous energy. It's like fighting a tarask, bro. Hang on, I'm gonna put this. <laughs> yeah, this is crunchy. Okay, that's what I normally do. I knew there was a way to do it. Okay. So if she moves, she'll take 14. 14. You got it. Give uh, another attack. So then I land on the ground and... Yep. So I guess if she wants an opportunity attack, she can technically have it. Uh, I mean, yeah, she'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, she'll use it to cast a spell. Cause we're caster shit. Oh no! Okay. Why did we not assume? That's so cool. Um, yeah, she will cast. Oh boy, so many decisions. Okay, it's not going to be as cool as you guys think it is. It's just going to be an inflict wounds. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, so, wow. Seven points of necrotic damage. <laughs> okay. Sad. Uh, I'll take the three. I mean, my shield will take three. Oh, great. <laughs> cool. <laughs> All right. That's the else? first points of damage you've taken the entirety of this session. <laughs> no, I took some temp like twice before. Oh, I yeah, think it takes a, a little bit of time. <laughs> a little bit of time. All right, Gallifrey. Anything else? Uh, no, that's me. Okay. Um, bu -bu -bu -bum. yeah. Legendary action. Legendary action. Bu -bu -bu -bu. Yeah. It's one person super vulnerable. She's not going to give that up for anything. Yep. Oh. Miss. Oh. Misses glazes off of your armor. That'll bring us to Zrash's turn. Uh, oh, I was dead. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, I guess we gotta get these sides out. I'm gonna be honest, bro. <laughs> yeah, I'm just yeah. get my turn now, right? No, no, your turn's next. No, oh, uh, okay. you're next. Yeah, you're next. Yeah, after mine. Sorry, things got crunchy. <laughs> these fights are very crunchy. Uh, so I guess I'm going to have to go try to destroy that scythe really fast. I, cause I, don't I mean, you're not going to go, you, you're not going to go at it out with one kill. It's preferable that you just go with her. And if Dawn is kind enough to heal me, if she's kind enough to heal me, then we can probably go from there. Oh, wait, I actually, wait, actually, I think this might be a good play. Um, hmm. grab, grab Lucius, move him up. So they can't reach him if he if he fails the con save again. So move. I him mean, up. they have six. They have sixty feet of movement. Exactly. Like they're we gonna get there him, anyway. Move, them, move you above sixty feet. He he's the thing's literally right next to him. I can't move that far. Yeah, attack of opportunity and whatnot. Just uh, let it let him do his thing. It does not provoke attack of opportunity actually, which is why I'm suggesting it. Well, it, like, it'll, that, still, well it'll, it'll still only, be able to follow be, him. It's only gonna be that side. But the other three sides won't be able to get to him, is what it's I mean. Also, it's also halved movement to move another creature. 
Exactly. Yeah, uh, so but I, I think it might be. I don't want the other three to get to him. At least move him up like ten feet. Dude, it's fine. If if, if Dawn can get me on her turn, I can probably survive until that. Well, that's okay. the thing. Yeah. <sighs> okay. I, I I have a I can, but I want to I do I wanted you not to play and hopefully concentrate all those attacks on me. Guys, what, worst case scenario, y'all can heal me back from up if I don't die. If okay. I die, I die. Okay. Okay. Well, okay. anyway. We'll go. Oh, all right. All right. Yeah. Do your thing. So, Do your thing. So now. just just yeah. go just go for Pandora then. Do your thing. Uh, yeah. Whatever you want. That, that uh, was just my. Is she, con is she concentrating on this, by the way? You have to find out. That's a good check, actually. That's a good check to make. All right. Well, then I am going to uh, go straight into her face. Go uh, swoop down and start swinging again. Okay. Hopefully, I can get better <laughs> hits this time. Good God! Right, I'm doing reckless ones. Okay. I'm all of certain death. Yikes. Twenty-nine. I can't apparently do any damage. Do you have 50 feet of movement speed? But it doesn't matter because you could just free fall and then catch yourself. So I'm good with that. I'm gonna shut up. You're not adding your rage damage though. Mm. Like, that's 29 certainly hits. Oh right. yeah, we do have to remember that. So plus four. Sorry. No, you're good. This is the first time I've ever used a barbarian. So, so. 13. <laughs> it's all good. I just so realized that too. <laughs> six points of damage. Got it. Yeah, that's not gonna trigger concentration. Yeah, that's definitely not. Uh... Hmm. I kind of want to actually try something, just real quick. I okay. want a birth weapon. Okay. This bitch, uh, the other direction was was supposed to be, but... You have this on deck safe since they're grappled, right? Uh, no, that's something else. Grapple just reduces that's their... That's incapacitated. Okay. Yeah, this just reduces their speed to zero. Okay. Uh, breath weapon. By the way, to turn him, you can hold shift or control. I know you struggle oh. with that. Now you're all good. I didn't know that at all. All right. DC 17. She tries to dodge out of the way from the brunt of it. That will succeed. She'll take 10 points of psychic damage. Well, that's nice, at the very least. By the way, she is unable to heal again, because I did hit her with the Maul of Certain Death. You are correct. Add another disease on there. Pew, pew, pew. I guess it's cursed, actually. All right. Anything else with your turn? Uh, I don't think so. Looking through my shit. Uh... Don't think so. I'm good. Okay. Yeah, all legendary actions have been used. That'll bring us to Dawn. What do you got? So I have a question. Sorry, can you scroll down a little bit to see how close I am to the uh where exactly is the crystal? I because I've been looking at it throughout even before like the whole like thing went down. Is it like here? Oh, there's lots of them. There's one, there's a big one here. Oh, there's, there's a big, big one there. Excellent. Yeah, there's a big one in cool, here. Cool, cool, there's cool, lots, cool, cool, yeah, there's cool, lots cool. of them. Um, so just just so I make I'm making sure, my, the big one is like oh right over here. Interesting, interesting. That is a interesting. cloud of smoke which you can't see yes. into right now. But I've been looking at it for so long. <laughs> <laughs> what are you trying to do? I've been I've been inside checking it for so long. <laughs> I'm just trying to see if that if I hit it would it be with without disadvantage because it'd be inside checking for so long. You can also oh. just move to the other one on the right. Yeah, it's an, true. It's an object, so you yeah, you it wouldn't have disadvantage anyway. Yeah. So here's there. what I'm going to do. I'm going to be right over here with my thirty feet of movement. So okay. I'll be I'll be like right oh shoot. I can get you if you want. I'll be right over here. So okay. this should cover everybody with my um very convenient Twilight Cleric ability, and I'm going to take swap my um, Serpent's Fang with my Heavy Crossbow, as you said I could before. Yes. And since I kind of generally know the direction of big 
crystal dude because I keep insight checking him. I keep looking at him. I'm gonna fire at him. Objects don't crossbow. move and they can't dodge and they don't wear armor, so I'm okay. Wonderful, with that. wonderful. Okay, I will fire and hopefully hit. Please, Lord in heaven. Oh, 19 plus 9, 28. Oh, wow. 28. That would hit her. Certainly hits. And I'm going to Divine Spite because I have it with my uh, weapons, right? It might, it, specify, it might specify melee. melee. It might specify no, it's, melee. No, it's actually attack. I'm pretty sure. Ooh. Let me just make sure. Okay. Um, bum, bum, bum. Let me check. I can't find it suddenly. When divine you strikes. hit with the melee weapon. weapon attack. Oh, divine no. strike. Divine strike says once strike. every turn when I hit a creature on a weapon attack, I can cause the attack to do an extra 2d8 of radiant damage. Beautiful. Does it work if I do radiant damage, DM? Radiant damage has no effect. <laughs> okay. Well, it's good I checked. Um, in that case, um, I will have you. What did I hit with that one? I hit with 10, I believe, for crossbow damage. Okay. 10 points of damage. Yeah. You got it. You fire this. Okay crossbow bolt into the smoke you hear a very satisfying ping and a little bit of a cracking had some kind and of then effect I'm cool I'm going to yell out to the others and be like hey guys you want to run our plans better hit the crystal things they can't fight back they're not radi they're not susceptible to radiant but otherwise you know have at it and I'm going to grin at them and I'm just going to like hold my place there and I'm going to actually re-roll re my temp because I don't think my temp was that good, so... Okay, go for it. Is that your turn? No, that's my spell casting. Sorry. Ignore that. Hey, ignore that. Let me let me roll my... um. Yeah, that's my turn. Sorry, go on. Okay. No, you're all good. All right. Ooh, that... 22. Very nice. Very good. All right, that will bring us to uh, Neji. All right, I'm going to fall prone with her. Okay. Are you ending with my circle? So, both of them... Uh... If you're going to inflict another condition, which is prone, on top of grappled, you're going to have to make another athletics check. Got it. This will replace one of your attacks. Okay. Okay. That's, gonna, that's not going to do it. Unless they roll a one. Oh, oh no. I have bless. Wait, I have bless. She's strong. Wait, I oh, have bless. Oh, he has bless. Fuck! Oh, wait. Still revives. Okay, that's completely fair. <laughs> uh, come on, just roll higher. You need to. Was that natural twenty or no? You <laughs> wrestle her to the ground. Hold on. Oh, okay. All right. Nice. So they're prone now. Indeed. Seven to win dash action, 100, 110 feet up. I'm going to fucking suplex them. <laughs> <laughs> Everything for a joke, I guess. That's 120 feet up. I'm suplexing. How's it 100? Oh, step of the wind. Step of the wind, yeah. baby. <laughs> Okay. God damn it. I'm suplexing, boys. Dragon. Suplex city. So Let's that's. Go. That 100, is. 120 feet. 12 d6 of damage. It's terminal. Okay. It's terminal damage. Yeah. And you. And oh, and you have slow fall. This would normally fall. affect me, but I have slow fall. Oh. Oh wait. Okay. So as you leap up into the air, suplex her into the ground. Non magical damage, no effect. Yep. That there you is go, Jane. so lame. <laughs> is she prone? James, you should. Floor. She's no. prone. But she's, she's prone. prone. They're on the floor prone now. Um, does Sife's also get an attack of opportunity on me? Three of them? Yeah, yeah they do. They all have disadvantage because no, of, of my boost of speed. 
You shot if you shot straight up to do a suplex, all four of them get an attack of opportunity. Okay, yeah, uh, please do. They all have disadvantage because of my boosted speed. Huh? They all have disadvantage due to my, my boosted speed. Huh? Oh yeah. Uh -huh. Let me click on it. Let me click on it for you. Uh, boot speed. <laughs> oh, but you have an opportunity I'm just attacks. mocking. I'm just mocking the DM. No, you're good. <laughs> <laughs> I remember now. Okay. Uh, alright, all four of them. Let's see what happens. Oh, forgot to roll disadvantage on that one. It's okay. That doesn't hit anyway. Nope. Definitely not. They only roll well for me, I guess. Apparently so. Well, I mean, they do have disadvantage on me. <laughs> I mean, that but the true. thing is, have you noticed that every time it's not rolled against me, they roll below 10? I mean, that's true. Do they all because do the attacks? Because I'm an immigrant. Oh yeah, they all take the attacks of opportunity, absolutely. Oh, 25 yeah. meets it, beats it. Uh, parry. Okay. <laughs> and I have one more attack, and I'm going to attack with advantage of my Advantage Quarter Staff. <laughs> okay. Uh, the first attack. Yep, I have nope. a <laughs> advantage. You said. No. Well, you used you used one of your attacks to incur prone. This is my second attack. No, that was a suplex. Oh. No, it wasn't. I I just moved. Oh, that was movement. Just my movement. Yeah, that's movement. Yeah, yeah. That that's was just good my point. movement. Okay. Yeah, he's right. All right, so that will be twenty-eight points. Of damage. Wait, I can Any crit. Chance. Oh, oh my God! Wait, the adamantine crits also. It bypasses the crit immune. Oh. Right? Nope, you're correct. Thank you. Oh. Good catch. <laughs> right? Oh, okay. Oh, Good catch. oh, that would have been so cool. <laughs> so, twenty-two points of damage. <laughs> okay, okay, that would have been cool though. <laughs> Is there any chance that she? Oh no, on an eleven, I'm sure she can't concentration. Yeah. Uh, yep, that's gonna be my turn. Uh, Negi will just go up to Draco Slam! And then he'll fucking slam him to the ground and realize it's nothing. Naughty! Not even a scratch. Not even and, and a drop of blood. I yelling at just... all of y'all to crack the crystals for like three and then, and then And then he just jabs him in the side with his quarterstaff. You won't win! Okay. Is that your turn? Yeah, that's my turn. <laughs> They are prone and grappled. All right. Oh, and you ended it with, in my Twilight Zone, right? Roll that 10 pitch points. Yeah, roll oh, those yes. 10 pitch points. Um, all right. Oh, nice. She... I mean... People can give me insight checks if they want again. I mean, I guess I can't, right? Yeah, you can't. Ooh. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> well, those with counter spell, I should have clarified. Okay. 23. Gallifrey, that familiar golden glow of light within her eyes begins to shine as she is calling upon her innate magic. What would you like to do? Know what spell she's casting? You know that it is ninth level. Yikes. Seems worth a shot. Oh. Okay. It's, uh, it's her turn. She's going to counterspell it back. Well, I mean... Yeah, I'm going to counterspell it. I just got to... That'll be fourth level. Yeah. Okay. <sighs> she will also counterspell. I'll count us for her, uh, her counter spell. Okay. <laughs> We're counter spellception over here. Make an intelligence. Chess. Actually, change my mind. She's not going to counter spell. You can keep your you can keep your um spell slot, Kentrell. Oh. All right. Intelligence check, Gallifrey. Okay. Come oh, they're on. gambling. They're, they're gambling. The man. Oh, oh. 
Oh. It's gonna be a failure. Okay, the gamble worked. <laughs> as... Gallifrey, as you reach out to counterspell whatever happens, there is an invisible surge of energy that you can just feel with your proficiency in Arcana that floods from her. All of you hear the most painful scream in your minds <gasps> as she psychic casts scream. Psychic Scream. Oh my god. I'm going to need, I believe, everybody to Holy make... Holy fuck. I'm fucked. To make a what? To make uh, an intelligence, intelligence save. saving throw. Oh, fuck me. Okay, shit. Ah, uh, yeah, no, Rick, uh, Lucius is more than likely down. Yep, 90 feet. Ah! Oh, 19! 19 feet. Um, I'm going to use my Diamond Soul reroll that. Yikes. <laughs> Silvery barbs on Neji. Silvery barbs on Neji. Can someone counter spell that? No! Please. Can someone counter spell that? Yeah, I'll do it. Thank you. That's two. That's both their reactions down. Boy! What, what do I need to roll to counter spell? Only one of her reaction because I took back the other one. Oh. No, and the thing is, it automatically. Uh, yeah, barbs. nothing. Nothing for silvery barbs. Yeah. 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 Okay. Gallifrey, you succeed. But what if I. Wait, what if I. Can I silver. Can I silvery barbs at silvery barbs? No. No, no. It's already, really. been, it's no, already okay. been countered. It's already been countered. <sighs> oh. Okay, okay. oh, actually, Kentrel. We have to see what happens to your damage first. Oh, wait, you can't silvery barbs because here's what happens. Those who fail. You take 51 19. points of psychic damage. Wait, did I fail with a 19? You failed with a 19. Oh, fuck me. Okay. Well, at least I get 22 hit jumper hitch points, so it's not too bad. I'm a psychic dragonborn. I only take half, at the very least. Okay. 25. Um, Neji, reroll. Because Kentrel failed, which means he is stunned and cannot counterspell. Wait, does the reaction go first, or...? Nope. Goes the spell, he's stunned, and then she counterspells your... It all happens at the yep. same time, from what I understand. There you go. I'm gonna yeah, they... insult that again. I don't... I'm... <sighs> Read it, I don't know if you can. Let me see. <sighs> Uh, Lucius. Yep. Are you knocked to zero I hit am, points? I am not. I am. I have eleven hit points. Ooh, very very Woo! lucky. Wow. But Lucius is are... one tough motherfucker. You make a saving throw. You can spend one key point to re re roll it and take the second result. We already re rolled back. and took a second result and then silvery barbs. You already okay. used it. Yeah, okay. It's, it's, uh, yeah, you you're stunned. She turned you against you. Okay. Let me check. Uh... Damn. Yeah, it's it's a roll against silvery barbs, not a saving throw. Yeah, it's a roll against the spell. You can't re-roll against spells. It looks like. You can just re-roll a saving throw, and take right. the second result. The thing is, I'm not stunned because I'm already paralyzed, so it doesn't overlap. Well, it's two. It's from two different sources, so it does actually. Mm. I do believe. Mm. Can you be stunned and paralyzed at the same time? I don't. I mean, it doesn't, I mean, it doesn't really change over, anything if we're if we're going to be exactly real over overlap, not stack. <laughs> so really paralyzed incurs the condition um, incapacitated. It does not say stunned. So technically, you are under a different condition, which is stunned. 
Does that make sense? So They're two both. different conditions, technically. Both. Yeah, you're under cool. both. So I can't Diamond Soul cool. again? Nope. I'm gonna say no. Okay. Okay, yeah. Oh, man. Alright. Yeah, we went to winning from, uh, this is pretty even now. Okay, Gallifrey, let me check if it's half damage on success. It is. It is half damage, thank you. You're not stunned. And you're not stunned. How much damage? Thrash failed, 51. so he is stunned. 51, gotcha. Uh, man, that's, that's really bad. Um, <laughs> the, the Pegasus, the Pegasus head explodes. <laughs> <laughs> Pegasus is done. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> Yikes. Uh, I was only yeah, 10 feet up. <laughs> yeah, you're only 10 feet up, so you land on the ground. Uh, was anybody reduced to zero hit points? No. Nope. Nope. Okay. Good to know. Um, no, and it's outright die, not reduced to zero. The, if the the head blowing effect from Psychic Scream, I don't think, is reduced to zero. It's outright die. Yeah, yeah, that's what I meant. Oh. Um. Uh, okay. Wait, hold on. Turn to her. So, like, even if it's, even if someone was reduced to zero, they, their heads wouldn't pop immediately. If a target is killed, not yeah, killed. down. Mm. Okay. All right. Well, uh, I don't know about that. Yeah, we, that feels a little weird sure. to me. Yeah, the wording is. I think the wording is third death, third death save situation. Okay. Listen, DM. A horse's life hangs in the balance here. <laughs> <laughs> well, the horse is uh, well, NPC. I, it's, it's, saves. it's dead. It's killed. Yeah. It's it's yeah. explodes. Yeah, he's fine. He's okay. Fine. <laughs> uh, okay. So. Okay. Yeah, that's that. Wait, that really fucked us. Damage. Yeah. Okay, so she's going to take 14 points of thunder damage. I'll have you know you drew blood. <laughs> I drew blood. Yay. Uh, that is her action. That's her reaction. Okay. She is going to... Just holding. This Neggy just holding on while stunned. <laughs> do, do you, does your guys' flying equip... Uh, Lucius, does your flying equipment allow you to hover? Wing boots, so I believe so. Double check for me, please. It uh, might just give you a half, flying speed. Remember half movement, uh, because they're getting up from prone. Well, oh, you wear these boots, you have a flying speed equal to hiking speed. Oh, wow. <laughs> boots up to fly... He... Oh, if you're flying when the duration... I mean, I can use the boots to fly up to four hours all at once on several sort of flights, whatever. If you are flying when the duration expires, you descend at a rate of 30 feet. It doesn't specify... But it's continuous flight. Okay, so I do say I do think that you do start descending if you are not conscious to control the item. Okay, and so therefore I would be descending thirty feet per round, so I'm at thirty-five feet up. Yeah, you're at thirty-five yeah. feet up. Okay, she's gonna okay. going to foo -foo -foo, fly over there, get back up into the sky mm -hmm. because fuck you guys. <laughs> Uh, and that's going to be the end of her turn. That Sylvia Barb's really fucked me. I was uh, so happy for a moment, and then all the happiness went away. Yep. <laughs> I mean, okay. guys, I've been yelling for several rounds now to destroy the crystals. Uh, oh we God. don't know what we don't know what that will do. <laughs> I, I literally told you the crystals are her method of yep. like downing the other gods. Uh, yeah, end of but, your, yeah, but that's not killing her. Guys, guys, Kentrel, at the end of your turn, make an intelligence saving throw. Okay. Um. Oh wait, yeah, you guys have the aura. All right. So, mm -hmm. is this side within range for me to attack? You're stunned. No, you have to. You save. have to resist yeah, the stun condition. Yeah, this is turn, a yeah. this is a ninth level spell. This is bad shit. Okay. Gotcha. Yeah, this is th this was her breather. This is her breather round. Yikes. Okay. Fifteen. Yeah. Lucius. 
You well, guys are all dumbasses. <laughs> at the mm -hmm. actually end of Kentrell's turn, that will be oh. a legendary action. Yeah, she's gonna go to kill me. Yeah, it's fine. Probably just use scythes. Wait a minute, the scythes aren't near you. Since you descended. Oh. They, no, but they can move. Range. Yeah, they can move. Well, they can't move on their legendary action if they attack, unless they have a, you know? is going to... Either way, this is bad. <laughs> oh yeah, for sure. I don't think we're, I don't think this is a lose condition. I think we'll be fine, but this is really bad. Yeah, she's gonna do a flame strike. Oh yeah, no, I'm I'm toast. Yeah, we all auto failed that. Evasion still gives me half damage, but damn. Uh, no, you auto. Yeah, yeah oh. You yeah, auto they, I, I, I have evasion, yeah. On me mm. fail, strength and dexterity saving throws. Uh, what'd you say? Evasion? Yeah, when you suggest it to affect that lesson to make a dex save, you two will only take half. You said to, and only half damage if you fail. So I, I auto fail, so I still only take half damage. Feels weird, but I'll allow it because it's a one shot. Well, yeah, I, I would, mean, it says in, I would in argue evasion. that I would argue that you would have to be conscious and able to attempt to evade even with evasion. That, that's but, that's eh. fair. All right. It's just the wording on evasion is really fucky. Yeah, it is. Uh, so, yeah, everybody within that space, you auto fail if you're stunned and you take 15 points of radiant and 10 points of fire. That puts me one point. I had 11 <laughs> points. This deals 12 points oh. of damage to me. So I just take five, da ten damage altogether. Is this at the end of Control's turn or at the end of mine? Also, whoever end ends your turn would then. If, uh, with, okay, if I'm you, down. If, they're, if you're stunned, like if you end your turn in my in my area, you get temp HP. I think. I'm down. Um, what is the radius on your twilight thing? Oh, you're thirty, 30 feet up. Feet. Yes. Uh, so, Contrell, you do get temp HP. It's only oh, Don is Don. You failed as well, correct? Um, was I? Uh, was I in the range of the? Um... Oh yeah, it's ninety feet. Oh okay. What did I need to roll? Uh, it was an intelligence saving throw for Psychic Scream. Did you roll that? For oh, I already rolled. Scream? I already rolled that. I already rolled that. Sorry, I clicked again, oh. but I already rolled that. And I failed, and I already applied the damage. Okay. Okay, but you are okay. You're stunned, though. Cool. Um. Oh, you're. I'm stunned. Yeah, psychic scream. Give me one sec. So I was gonna say I'm trying to check your fly. I don't. Yeah, think... no, no, no. Let me just double check that because I'm actually not sure if I rolled for it. I'm trying to like scroll up. I did do an intelligence saving throw of 19. Was that for it? Okay, yeah, that, that failed. That was for it. Oh, okay. 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 So I yeah. am stunned. You are stunned, which means that you fall 30 feet and off the edge of the platform, it looks like. Oh, yeah. I did have... Well, I don't know if I... No, I don't, I don't think I activated it. And it's not dim light or darkness here, right? It's not what? Dim light or darkness here? Well, no, in your twilight is... aura it is. Ah, uh, okay. Okay. So Dawn falls off the edge of the platform. Due to, due to her positioning. Whee! Uh, Zrash, you also fall because I don't think your wing speed allows you to hover. Uh, but you're you're good on damage or whatnot. Okay. Sorry about that. Uh, Lucis, you can make a con save at the start of your turn against the paralyzed. I'm down. I'm oh, down. you're down. Okay. I'm down. You remain paralyzed. Well, Make a death saving thanks. throw. Wait, is this stunned or paralyzed? Which is the difference, or? Uh, he's both stunned and paralyzed. Oh, no. Yeah, okay. I'm not, I think, oh, I think the stun okay. goes away um, at the end of his turn. Paralyzed doesn't. Oh, no, it's a ninth level spell. That stun does not go away. Okay. No, you have to save from it. But I'm down, so if I pop back up, I'm Gucci. Uh, <laughs> where is... Oh, God. 
Uh, boop. That's a 22. 22 against... For death, right? Yeah, for death saving throw. Death save. This is not a charm effect, right? The char uh, the uh, stun? No, it's just stun. Hmm. Okay. No, we're fucked. We are fucked. I don't think we are. Okay. We are very inconvenienced, but I don't think we're fucked. Yeah, are you con uh, are you confirming if my aura applies to death saves? Um, no, no, that's not what I was confirming. I was confirming if temp hit points bring you back up, and they do not. No, it, they don't. They don't. Okay, but you do get them, which is good for you. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Let's see. Sides, sides everywhere. Uh, and we one... have to roll for this. It's an intelligence saving throw for the stunned. Yep, yep. At the end of your turn. Fuck. There's gonna be attack oh, against oh. Gallifrey. That misses. Ooh. On the first attack against Gallifrey. On the second one, nineteen, which I believe oh. also misses Gallifrey. Yep. Okay. Cool. Swing, swing. Nothing. Nothing. Uh, this one is going to take two attacks against Kentrel. Swing. Uh, I believe... Oh, no, it's with advantage. Oh. 21 to hit Kentrel. Oh. Nope. Which misses. Cool. Second attack. That'll be a natural Ooh. 20. That does oh, hit. Nice. Uh, that will be 18 points of necrotic and... Another 12 points of Radiant. I can resist the bow. Alright. This one is going to go against Neji. Uh, 15 it, Necrotic, yeah. 11 Radiant. Yep, resistant to both. Uh, and then 28, 16, and 5. And then okay. the only Scythe left hovering near Lucius. Does Ruthless. he have range to hit me? Oh, he Ru can, he yeah, can he move. Can float, float down uh, and is going to... Did you roll your attack? It's been fun, guys. I mean, it doesn't matter. It, it, it doesn't bring me back up. Right, but it could protect you from a failed death saving throw. Well, I'm, st yeah, I'm, no. I'm still, I'm still falling, but that doesn't mean my my aura is negated. It's still, it's still going. So does he get the advantage of the temp HP there or no? No, because the thing is, what does the temp HP do? Is just like I can't get temp HP if I'm not conscious. Well, you can, and it can protect you from a death save. But it cool, did crit. I guess uh, twenty. Okay, yeah, no, it did that crit. Doesn't... So that's twenty nine damage. Necrotic overwhelms. Well, no, because twenty nine no, halved cause... is fourteen. Yeah, it's... So temp absorbs the tw uh, the twenty absorbs the fourteen, which brings it down to six. Yeah. Which is then eighteen. Yeah, that's two failed death saves on the first attack. And I'm dead. And I'm dead. No, you have the three uh, failed to saves, right? Yeah. No, but he rolls a crit on the next one because I'm unconscious. <laughs> but he doesn't hit. Scythe doesn't hit. <laughs> Ricochets off of your uh, armor. Holy oh shit. Uh, <laughs> and I, uh, did, I mean, that's that's not your turn. It's um, uh, the Scythe's turn, right? That's the Scythe's turn, correct. Uh, okay. I right. do have a healing potion in my back pocket. I have two of them! Gallifrey, oh, really? you, Holy Gall shit. Gallifrey, it's your turn. I've just not had a turn in three rounds! <laughs> These... uh... This is, no, myth, myth, this is payment for when I fucked up the first game that I played with you. This is full payment and I deserve this. <laughs> oh my god! So are these hope, crystals? As well. It's like I have two potions of greater healing. Yeah. I have 75 points of lay on hands that I can use. <sighs> yeah, okay. It's just like, just someone touch me for one hit point, then I can probably survive some shit. enough to the crystal stuff. I'll move there. Okay. I don't think Attacks. I can fly. Attacks of opportunity from the sides. Okay. Okay. <laughs> the confidence. You just literally, like, so nonchalant. <laughs> Uh, 31. 
Uh, shield. You can beat a 31? I'm 28 base. Jesus Blade Christ. <laughs> Woo! Blade Song is kinda cool though. Alright, see if one crits. Nope, no crits. Cool. Fuck me. Yeah, are down too, that's good, that's good. Hey, now I attack. Okay. So... Uh, actually I'm gonna scoop more because I think I can... I'm gonna, I'm gonna attack this with the uh, green flame blade. Thing. Okay. Oh wait, that's smart. Oh. Then you can. Oh, that's does it smart. jump to the other crystal? Yeah, that's smart. Yeah, maybe. I've I been don't know. yelling for everyone to destroy the crystals for three rounds. Technically not, because it says creature, but whatever. Oh, never mind then. What says creature? Yeah, the green flame blade. Oh, okay. Uh, twenty-six right. certainly hits. I tickle it. Okay, and then. <laughs> you tickle it. Uh, then I'll do a second attack with my okay. rapier. Yeah, and hits. Then I'll do like is it is it breaking? All it takes is for two hits from a magical weapon for the radiant energy that has been siphoned to explode out of the crystal. Yes. Does that do anything to Pandora, though? That's the question. Make a dexterity saving throw, Calibre. No! Oh. Does yeah, it do anything to Pandora when we destroy it? And bless. And bless. I don't think it matters what we do to Pandora. It's what she wants to do to the rest of the gods. Okay. It doesn't, that it... doesn't matter for now. It does! Because oh, if we fail against her, like, the, or like, even if we succeed against her, this thing is already in motion. Uh, not the scythe, uh, but you take 15 points of radiant damage as this explodes in your face. Okay, so I take seven. Uh, but the, yeah, the connected points of crystals will <laughs> and go inert. Okay. Uh... So we don't need to destroy those now. Then I'll zoom over here. <laughs> and I'll use my haste action to do a booming blade attack, because that's more fun. Okay. Boom, baby. One. Hits. Okay. If it moves, it takes 17 damage. Keep that in mind, buddy. Begin that's to right. see <laughs> several cracks. <laughs> appear across its face, but it does not shatter. And you also know uh, the one that I attacked also, like, cracked. I'm gonna refresh my booming blade. Or I'm gonna start my blade song. That's okay. a bonus action. Alright, you got it. Uh, there we go. Okay, that is all the things that I can do. Okay. Legendary, last legendary action. Oh, thank God. Been fun, guys. Yeah, she is definitely going to toll the dead on Lucius. Yeah, it's not been me. Fun. As, I, as I came down, <laughs> they still, I'm they still, falling. They of course I'm not. Falling. Of course not. Of course not. She's not going to do you because I'm at the. I'm literally at death's door. But I'm falling. I'm a falling chicken. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> That was the thing that's already blew up some of her stuff that she's trying to do. Yeah, she's going to I, metamagic. I crack some stuff. Distant, toll the dead, banshee scream at him, um, and I'm not Luci gonna Lucius's eyes and just black blood explodes. His eyes melt into necrotic goo, and he falls dead in midair. Dead. All right, Zrash, intelligence okay. saving throw at the end of your turn. What do I have to beat? 23. I literally can't do that. Okay. Dawn, falling, plummeting through the clouds of this plane. I need, a, I need, a, I need to, like... Wait a minute, there's rocks under here. Look, there's pillars under the rocks, so they, would they fall on the rocks? Uh, well, it's... I technically... Here's the thing, though. I am on the very edge of this platform. Would I not fall on the platform? No. 
you're like you're like one quarter of covering the platform but i'm so, so small like, that a quarter of the platform means that i would follow the platform <laughs> it, says your, it says your size is medium no i'm a small am i not it says you're Wait, medium on, on my end oh <laughs> luck check wink wink luck check <laughs> if it was if it I'm was a medium more half, but i'm very small if it was more than half the space i would be okay with that but it is literally like a quarter a sliver of a corner i can't where you meet fall. the intelligence check i'm like plus two for intelligence for saving throws okay unless let me just double check something yeah double check bum, ba, 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 ba. I mean, I still get my temp HP, I guess, so I'll just, I'll just roll that first. Hold on. Um... This might be a TPK then. Help! I can still talk. Help! <laughs> well, you're stunned, so you actually can't. <laughs> no, I can't. I just looked at stunned. A stunned creature's incapacitated, can't move, can only speak falteringly. So I can't speak. Help! Barely. Falteringly, so... Help! Help! No. Help. Nope. Help. <laughs> no. Help. No. Is there a bird you guys hear? Uh, uh, yeah, that's. <laughs> <laughs> um. Well, does it? Okay, no. I. It that only gives me charmed effects. Ba ba ba. Destroy and dead. Steps of the night. Bonus action can. I can't do bonus actions at all, right? If I'm stunned. No you can't actions. Do anything. You just. Even if it's my uh, class features, feature, so it's not actually like a spell or anything else. If it takes an action of any kind, it cannot be used. How about a bonus action of any kind? That is an action. A laugh. Okay. <laughs> I did try. Um, At least you okay. try. I did yeah, try. Second scream actually really fucked us. Guys, yeah, we're all stupid. I mean, oh, this is you would know, my husband would know, I guess, because we know each other beforehand, that I have a staff of healing, I was going to mask your wounds you on the next round. Um, but if I... Wee! <laughs> Wee! Uh, Alright, you do, I'll say that's like... I'll say that's like 50 feet down, where you do impact the stone. So minus fifty. Oh, so, oh, okay. No, I can only do one saving throw. Yeah. All right, Neji, intelligence saving throw. All right. And guess what? I am go. I am in the aura of protection. So that's a plus three from Kentrell. So that's a. Wait, yeah. was I? I wasn't right because I was no. falling. Yeah. Yeah, so I Okay, re-rolling. <laughs> it's only ten feet, right? It's pretty sure gonna, it was, right? You're gonna distance that silvery barbs there? Yep. Alright. Diamond Soul. Okay, so here's what happens. Jesus Christ. He looks at uh, Lucius' dead body. You killed my new friend! You're paying! We could have done this peacefully, but I see there's no other way! <laughs> you want to see my true power? Fine! <laughs> and you see he powers up, you see yellow energy all around him. As he, <laughs> and then... And then... He screams out... <laughs> and then you see him standing there with yellow hair and, and just green eyes as he just looks on. You're gonna pay! Right. <laughs> so I like how you said at the beginning that this wasn't completely an XP of Goku. 
Hey, hey. Screw you. <laughs> <laughs> now um, it is. So, I know this is, isn't going to matter, right? But I have my Radiant Soul. Can I, as for flavor, can I just activate that? Since I, I don't do any, I don't do any Radiant damage anyway. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. <laughs> he just on. You're gonna pay. <laughs> <laughs> He's Super Saiyan now. I don't have Super Saiyan art for him, but there you go. All right, what do you got? You're gonna let me have my turn? Oh no, that's gonna be turn, right? <laughs> <laughs> that would have been so cool. <laughs> all right. Um. All right. That is going to bring us to Pandora's turn. I'll also let you guys know, because you guys knew me beforehand, you would have known that I have the means to um, bring a certain downed companion back to life if you get me up fast enough. I don't have anything for you, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm just saying, I'm just letting y'all know. Wait, what? Yeah, I, I don't think I can help you <laughs> with being... I don't have greater restoration or regular restoration, so it's nothing I can do. <laughs> Am I the only one with... Okay, it's fine. You're gonna have to wait a minute, buddy. She Ooh. is going That's one round, though, right? to fly no. forth. Oh, it's like 10 rounds. Shit. Uh, <laughs> the ruthless enemy. Lucius. He's already dead, isn't he? I'm already Let dead. What do you something. want from me? <laughs> do you want to go to bed? There, is my question. <laughs> do, you, do you want me to play for you? No. I, I was asking if you want to go to bed. Dude, I'm fine. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. She's not going to fly up then. <laughs> I was going to teleport your ass. Actually, I think it's willing creatures, so it doesn't matter. Oh, sure. No, she goes back. <laughs> it's willing creatures. <laughs> okay. Um. Why don't you come at me, you coward? <laughs> Super Saiyan mode, let's go. Yeah, okay. I have no mechanical benefit from this. <laughs> well, I used to. Now I don't, because they're immune to radiant, but... Yeah, and just to confirm, I mean... DM, even if I, like, if, even if I rolled a nat 20 intelligence, it wouldn't have helped me at all? Um, no, unfortunately not. So... Just so everybody knows, at this point why I'm pulling out all the stops. So I put a certain amount of HP and was going to see if that would be reasonable. But that's not reasonable, clearly, since we're a little bit over time. It's a long fight, yeah. Yeah, so there's going to be... Um, yeah, so there was some balance that I was going to decide on, and I've decided on it. We Therefore, also started about two hours late. Yeah, that's true. Eh, only like 30 minutes late, actually. Yeah, I was gonna say, two hours is a little much. Um, yeah, no, we're fine. But yeah. <laughs> also, uh, actually, is your estimate even visible? It is visible. Okay. She's actually pretty hurt. Yeah, she's near death. Yeah. Yeah. So, this is why I'm gonna I pull out of the stops, basically. She is going to... Yeah, she's gonna fly forth... 20 feet, a little bit down, she should be 40 feet up, sorry. And then I am going to need Neji. Mm -hmm. Double check something, I wouldn't, no, I wouldn't do that, that's fucked up. Do what? <laughs> I would do that though. Foundry, this is a bad time. Okay, there we go. So, whatever you want. Okay. 
she's mind. going to use meta magic point to twin cast that will fail so i will need the both of you to make wisdom saving throws okay i got it we, we got advantage on that remember that you do well does heroes feast says against i think it says against it's all blade. saving throws no it's all saving throws okay yep not 20. Mm -hmm. you want to silver you that yeah Fuck. yeah you want to silver Yo, it's all thingy? wisdom saving throws with advantage yeah it's all wisdom saves yeah okay I just wanted, yeah, I'm just checking for my own memory because if I read it, I'll remember for the future. Yeah, all oh, wisdom saving throws with advantage. Um, <laughs> yeah, she would definitely silvery barbs that. You got it. Nope. All right, doesn't matter. She tries to exert her influence upon you and you resist it. Gallifrey, what'd you <laughs> get? You'll pay. Huh? Wisdom saving throw. She twin spelled. Oh, I, I don't know. Was that me? Uh, find out. That's 20. barely a pass. Three. Holy as shit. I see a 20. Is... Oh, bless. That's right. 23 That's meets it. That's barely a fucking pass. <laughs> wow. That's good. That's good. Okay. Also, my mom came in the room. You're being too loud. Stop screaming. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Is she wrong? Is she wrong, though? <laughs> yeah, you have been screaming a lot. I've only been screaming when Nike powers up. She is going to quick and cast Chill Touch. On... Can she use more than one meta magic option? This is a different spell. Yeah, she can use one more meta, more than one meta magic option. They have to be out soon. Though. This is a boss fight, man. She exceeds some of the abilities Every, within TNT. I'm, I'm going. going. I know, I know. Dude, they're paladin and level twenty sorcerer. Yeah, no, they gotta have. Okay, she is going to. <laughs> As payment for fucking up your class, Lucius, she's gonna tilt touch your dead body no, so it DM, can't be healed. I, I'm just gonna I'm gonna push back. I was no. a if you if you look at my D D beyond, if you look at the racial trait size, your medium size all small. You can choose the size when it's like this race, I was small. Okay. Okay. Uh they have disadvantage because they're uh, prone to range spell. He's in the air. True, He's not though, prone. I, I am. So just so you know, I, I didn't oh, mind, fall 50 feet. I just I fell 30 feet down to the first platform. Yeah. Yes, you're good. OK. I had a Super Saiyan 3 theme pulled up on my phone. Do you really need that. to do that to me, Mithrin? Do you really hate me that much? I don't hate yes. you, but she certainly hates your character. She is a ruthless, <laughs> she's a ruthless smart person. <laughs> All I want to say is I hope my goddamn joke character does not get the final hit again. <laughs> uh, all right, that's going to be the end of her turn. Uh, control, uh, give me an intelligence saving throw. Okay. We're at the very, very end of this combat. She's very close, or you guys are going to die. I don't know. Nope. <laughs> Damn it. Nope. Okay. Damn, you got to get a nat 20. A natty 20. All right, Lucius, yep. very dead, can't be healed. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm, I no, I could, I could revive them. All of you know this. No, she didn't. We literally, we literally she can't healed. get you. Yeah, no, we literally can't get you though. I'm not that far down. I'm on the platform. Oh, yeah, you're I'm not stunned. All the way down. It, it doesn't matter. She chill touched me. I can't be healed. As yeah, you cannot the... regain hit points. Uh, I'm not Nagy. saying regain hit points. I will stop you from dying. As a scythe go up. You literally see him just use his vision. She looks to the fucking scythe, and it just bounces off his fucking key. I cast shield. Jesus Christ. No more games. All right. Then the... This one is going to go after his rash. This one Two is attacks. going to go after Kentrill. 
Oh, I guess it wouldn't move there. Yeah. Uh, are you going to do your second attack on me? Uh, no, it misses. Well, we'll see if it crits, I suppose. No, you have two attacks, right? Oh, natural 20 hits past your shield. Okay. Well, yeah, no, you do have two attacks, so. Yeah, the sides do have two attacks. Um, okay. So, yeah, that's going to be uh, a crit on you. Also. I yeah, manifested fine. that somehow, so that'll be <laughs> 27. Uh, that'll be 21, da 21 damage. Okay, 21 damage. You got it. On its second attack. Yeah, sure, this one will see if it crits. Nope. Uh, this one will be up against Cantrell. Wait, why'd you have advantage on me? Uh, two attacks it. on a different scythe. Oh, okay, different type. Okay. Yeah. I was confused for a second. Uh, none of those hit. Uh, and this will be on Zrash. Oh, sorry, that's with advantage. Wait, all of you are still my, uh... No, you're 50 feet down. No, she's no, back I'm not. I'm she's 30 small. feet down because yeah, I'm small. She's small. Oh. Um, okay, oh. so. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Zrash, that'll be 21 and 13. Uh, I believe your oh, rage so is. I uh, yeah. believe your rage is gone because you did not attack or take an attack last turn. A uh, relentless rage. Oh. Okay. You ended your turn to my thing, technically, right? Yeah, so... Because last time. Oh, yeah. so it, it doesn't even damage me. It just goes through my turn. Okay, that's good. Okay, that's a good call. Yeah, the, good call. the boundary you. just didn't pick. <laughs> Tiny bird at the bottom. When the, crit, <laughs> when the crit does no damage, like, okay. So when the crit does no damage, you see the scythe just fucking bounce off his chest. His fucking shirt gets ripped off. Okay, so Rare Limitless Rage is you can keep it? fighting despite your Grievous Runes. If you drop to zero hit points while you're raging, you don't die. You make a con save if you exceed drop to one hit point. The other one, then. It's the other rage one, whatever it is, then. Uh, persistent Rage, sorry. Only if you fall unconscious or if you choose to end it. Persistent Rage. Oh, level 15. All right, you got it. Incredible. All right, so it'll be half that 21 and that 13. This brings us to the second attack. 13. Uh, which I believe misses. Cannot get past your armor. That'll be Gallifrey's turn. Okay. Uh, my luring attempt failed. So I'll go here. Aw, oh, damn it. Uh... Give me an insight check, Gallifrey. Insight. Okay. No, oh, no idea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like I said, it just failed. Okay, uh... How far am I supposed to get for this? 90. Okay, so not that far. I don't want to retract it. Whatever. Uh... I shoot... Level five, chromatic orb, I choose cold. At her. At her, okay, you got it. Cool. Cool. You made good plays this game, but like Psychic Scream is just so goddamn potent. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's her literally end all be all uh, spell. Yeah, de yeah, definitely. Oh, mm -hmm. once. Yeah, I literally, I literally wouldn't use it. Um, I even have it like on the stat block that she doesn't use it until she's hurt. Yeah, um, I was so excited for rolling a nineteen, oh, and they still failed. What did I add? Oh, it's in my notes. Because we were, we were doing super well, but then Psychic Scream came, and then we got fucked. <laughs> yeah. Yep. You see, like, one wing lifting up from when Dawn is being like, I'm still doing, doing like, uh, clearing shit. Yes, 25. So you, what you mean is we were doing well until we stopped. 22 points <laughs> of damage. Yeah. Cool. All of that damage goes through. Very good, Gallifrey. Okay. And then I'll do my second attack, and I'll make it a... Uh... Cantrip? Yeah. Nice. Um... The only one that works is Firebolt, so... Chromatic Orb is a great spell for getting past resistances. Just saying. I love Chromatic Orb. Uh, yeah, no, Chromatic Orb is definitely underrated. Two points of Firebolt damage. Ding. 
Oh, well, 22 does hit. I think their AC is 22. No. Ooh. Let's blast it. It's 25. I mean, 25 definitely hits. <laughs> I remember I did a chromatic orb of acid down like an artifact and just like the BDM was like, you what? I'm like, yeah. Now that the ghost is coming towards me? No? All right, that's you, Gallifrey. Yep. <laughs> okay, so Zrash literally cannot succeed against the intelligence saving throw. Uh, I Don, am stuck here. What is your intelligence yep. modifier? It's for saving throws. It's a plus two intelligence. You literally cannot save against Psychic Scream. Neji. Um, he, out of pure fucking anger, will, uh, rush up, uh, screaming out, and, And this uh, is for a minute, right? This is what? Just go this right is for up. a minute? Uh, ba -ba -ba -bum. No, it just lasts until you save against it. Ninth That's level. That's fucked. It's a yeah, very, that's... very good spell. She will add a Mantine Quarterstaff. Uh, I'm going to use a key point to reroll that. I think I can do that. Mm, I know no, that's I can't. Gunslinger, I was going to say. <laughs> Lucky or Gunslinger. Uh, Misses. I am going to favor the gods. And roll 2d4 and add that to my roll. And that is that is a uh, 23, 23 with bless. Uh, that'll hit 25 that'll hit. to hit. Okay. For that 20 hits. for 28 points of damage. Neji, how do you want to do this? God damn it! <laughs> the choke character. So you know how I said in the beginning, I made the pole red. Sure. Never, ever seen the power pole yeah. from Dragon Ball Z, from Dragon Ball? I mean, if you want to be psychical, <laughs> Sun Wukong has a red pole as well. I know. So, you see uh, Neji, after he goes Super Saiyan, you'll burn! And then he'll, uh, out of pure anger, the pole extends, hit, hits Pandora directly in the chest for the first for the first one. Then he'll, then he'll fucking jump on the staff, run up the staff, and will then... Smack them right upside the head, non lethally. Non lethally. Yes. <laughs> well, she cannot be knocked unconscious. She is still at one hit Miss, point. I'm a yes, Miss, I'm a go to <laughs> Miss, I'm a go to bed. You sure? Miss, Miss, I'm a go to bed. <laughs> Thanks. Fine, a flurry Thanks. of bliss. <laughs> yeah. I used my stuff power. Right. I hit, you, I you hit. <laughs> you kill her. Uh, and... Right before you don't kill it, you hear angry squawk from below. <laughs> As you see, everybody, you see, uh, you see, every, you see, Maggie do the anime chop on the back of the deck, try to knock it about. This is what you get. Again, now, I'm angry not gonna squawk kill from below. Still up. <laughs> angry squawk from below. I'm hissing like a fucking angry croc. Crocodile before the right before now. the lethal chops up, they're at one HP and give you one last chance. I don't want to kill you. You killed my friend though, and I shouldn't give you the same mercy. No, kill like, him. Like, do, do you hold? Do you Jesus. hold your turn? No. Well, I mean, her, just, just, her. just no. Just kill him. <laughs> It's fine, just kill him. I, I can Dang. bring him back if need be. Okay, it's just flavor. We all know. You know you hold, I can bring you, them back if you need be. Do you hold your turn? I fucking kill her. Thank God. <laughs> but like, okay, oh, just let me just let me say my thing. This is part of my kill. Do you uh. truly want to be a better person? At this point, she kills herself. Like, Jesus Christ. <laughs> She's like, <laughs> help me. I fine, can't do this fine. to myself. I will staff a power and we'll just slam it through their chest. Okay, thank God, because she was going to cast Gate and get the fuck out of Dodge. Oh my God. <laughs> they have two knife. Okay. I'm sorry. Uh... 
Wait, who who was down? Okay, so uh, here's how I imagine. Lucius. Here's how I imagine this. Uh, uh, Nike runs up, hits him with the quarter staff, then accidentally kills him. <laughs> Wait, who was down? I, I uh, Lucius. Lucius is down. Okay. Okay. But okay. We're over... finish, finish what you were saying. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I was gonna say we're over time. So for the sake of <laughs> brevity. Brevity. Yeah. Let me stay dead for the love of God. <laughs> nope. <laughs> no, 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 I wake up on the floor of Viva Park. No, yeah, I I'm like, okay, what? Guys, I just wanna, guys, I just want to say, I played joke characters three times in my friend's game. Every single one of them got the final hit on the final boss. It's a little All ridiculous. All three of them, I was here. <laughs> First, it was Dick Kickem. Dick Kickem. He was literally the MVP of that entire combat. Then you played Toy. And then fucking Mr. Bigley with his 16 attacks. Okay, and anyway. And then it's a Super Saiyan. I hate you. Sorry, I hate go on DM. Story-wise, for the sake of brevity, using your guys's, um, I assume, Don, that you're going to go over and cast Revivify upon oh, Lucius. absolutely, yeah. Okay. You and cast... I will also cast some mass cure wounds on everybody. And you I, got it. This is what I was trying to do for so long. Ah! You got it. So you cast, you cast Vivify and Lucius, you cast Mask Your Wounds, everybody is back up. You guys begin to see this shimmering silver energy begin to surround you as you hear uh, Jiraiya's voice. Return, champions. You have been successful. And you all are pulled from this space through that same tunnel of weave that you were sent here through. But as you look down the tunnel, you see that the remaining crystals of the platform charge up. And with a okay. burst of energy, the entire contraption disappears through a plane shift. What if that's crap, though? No. You guys are pulled back into the temple of the Raven Queen. And Zariah, with her hand still kind of held up, that shimmering energy from her eyes dissipates. Those wings disappear. And she collapses on the ground. This is the fucking worst wedding reception I've ever been to. Absolutely. Absolutely. Nike unturned Super Saiyan. I didn't mean to kill him. What do you mean you oh, did Dude, it's fine. Dude. 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 <laughs> Fucking screams. Nagy, 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 are you looking? Do you know about it? Do you know who? What? Do you it's know okay, who? Guys. Just give me a, just who give asked? me a long rest and who I can asked? have like... Who asked? Uh, Don, do you have anything that can cure a level of exhaustion? Um, I have greater restoration. You have spell slots left? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Then you can save Zariah's life as she had five levels of exhaustion and was set to die in the next 24 hours from her oh, shit. usage of that divine boon that she was given all those months ago. Yeah, I, I, I have, um, I still have another fifth level spell slot left. So, yeah, great restoration to her. Hell yeah. I use... <laughs> Yeah, that's fu this is fucked. <laughs> James, but James, let it let it end. I'm sorry. But you did stall a threat. It wasn't quite eliminated, you felt, as the contraption disappeared. But at least for the day, the gods are safe. Give me eight hours of rest and I can come back with a locate object. Just give me one second. I <laughs> Okay. All right. I'm gonna t thank you, anybody who might have watched this recording. Uh, we'll see you next time. Have a good night. So hey, like, and, like and subscribe. Oh, bye, YouTube. I guess that's right. Anyway, yeah, bye, YouTube. I, I forgot. Bye. Yeah, I forgot.